who is an Arabic teacher, and he is trying to prove that uh, David Wood was wrong. <coughs> hello, Hassan. Hey, hello. How are you, Muhammad? Hello. Yes, Muhammad. What do you want to say to us? Go ahead. Uh, where do you live, by the way? I live in USA, Muhammad. Where do you live yourself? Oh, you don't live in UK because Shamsi is from UK. Who cares if he is in UK or not? He can call me, can't he? Because you remember he told you in, in the video that he he is willing you to come to UK to debate with him. My friend, I don't, I don't, I don't, I, I am not a street boy. I don't debate in street. I'm not a street boy. So Just that means that... you're scared or what? I don't know. Well, the one is scared is the one who don't accept. Here we go. You are calling me. Look how nice the no, voice no. is. Look, look, look. Look how nice the voice. Look how clear it is. I can show reference on the screen. You can show me reference and we can show it in the screen. We don't want to sit there shouting at a bunch of kids and everybody shouts, say nothing. Uh, but but he ha but you guys have to agree on conditions. That's why. Well, I, I know there is no condition. The conditions goes for me, goes for him. He can call me anytime. He can ask anything. I can ask anything. That's very simple. It's a debate. You but, see, when you put conditions, it means you are scared of something. A condition like what? We should wear. No, no, it, we should have umbrella. No, it makes order. You know, like you guys, you, you keep picking. You know, unclear verses in the Quran. And then my friend, you, okay, you here we go. You are here with me. Give me a clear verse in the Quran, and I will show you in two seconds that it's not a clear. Choose one. No, no. No, no. You see, just me. to show you that, just to show you, no, 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 I am not no, the no, one no, is picking no, up no, a clear and a clear verses in the Quran. The Quran is a clear book. What are you talking about? Show me one that verse in the Quran is it clear. Can you show me one verse in the Quran clear? It's a stupid book with my respect Quran to you, my friend. A, no, no, in the Quran, there's a verse that says that those people who have disease in their heart, they keep picking and choosing the unclear verses to miss. Yeah, and me. the problem is That's any right. verse we pick up, you say to us you have a disease in your heart because you have no answer for it. And let me ask it's you a question. Unclear. Let me ask you a question. What kind of it's a book? Unclear. What kind of a book? There's a verse in the Quran you say this says that, right? This is a chapter three, verse number seven. What kind of a book says? That there is verses in the Quran, nobody knows what they mean, save Allah. What the point of sending those verses then? We have hadith to explain to it the hadith, the prophet. prophet so, so th then if this is the case, what is your problem if I pick up a hadith which is hard to understand if you have the backup yeah. from the hadith? That's not my point. What I said is that. No, you, your point is know. your point is I am picking up a weak spots in the Quran. You are just confessing that the Quran have a problems, and I go and I bunch the Quran. I, I bunch the Quran that. in the belly. I bunch I the Quran unclear. between the legs. I, I bunch the Quran in the, in the places I should not punish because you are no, saying the Quran unclear, is weak. Unclear. I said unclear verses. Unclear. Yeah. So okay. What what does unclear mean? What does unclear mean? Any clear to me or unclear. to you? Unclear to me or to Let you? Let me give you example. Any clear to me, my friend? Any clear to me or to you? No, I'm. I'm just. I'm just. I'm just stating what. what no, no, no. Is you need to answer me here when you say there is a clear, any clear verses, any clear to me or any clear to you. Unclear to everyone who. who likes Thank you very much, God. Did you hear this? The Quran have verses any clear to everyone. So what the point of sending those verses? Why your prophet no, did not explain them? Unclear to everyone who lacks knowledge, who doesn't have knowledge. It's unclear to that's that's false, my friend. That's false. That's false. That's false. That's false. The Quran says the Quran says the same verse. The same verse. You do not know your book. Obviously, you do not know your book. The Quran says, and those who who have knowledge, they say we believe. They don't know. The one who have knowledge to have knowledge in Islam is not about knowing. It's about that's just we, we believe. We have the prof prophetic tradition to explain those verses that are unclear. It doesn't mean that everything is unclear. My friend, I just told you. I just told you, my friend. Did you hear me? I just told you. Pick up for me one verse in the Quran, and this is the challenge. Choose for me something clear in the Quran. Like uh, I can't think of out of head now, but this. Okay, let me ask you. Let me ask you. I will give you something very simple in the Quran. The Quran keeps yeah. saying the children of Israel, the children of Israel, the children of Israel. Correct? Do you agree? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Who are the children of Israel? It's Moses. They okay. are from Moses. Who was Israel? The children of Israel means the the Jewish. It means my friend who is Israel children of Israel is the Jews I got you but who is Israel Israel is a tribe or something who is what yeah. tribe. Tribe. tribe no it says yeah Benny Israel it's Israel is a man children of Israel Israel that's is a man, nickname, not... man that's the nickname because it that's a nickname uh, that's a nickname okay where do you get that this is a nickname and where do you get the word that this is a tribe where do you get this information israel, from when israel is a clan from their origin my friend their, who, what is israel okay they are they are the children of israel who is israel because the most prophets were from because israel. what because what is the name of i'm saying you who is israel i'm asking a very simple question 
the Quran repeat tons of time all children of Israel 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 all over okay who is Israel imagine I say to you imagine I say to you all children of Trump all children of Trump all children of Trump all children of Obama all children of George Bush all children of etc but I never introduced to you first who is a Trump who is Obama who is who is Israel introduce to me go ahead that's the language of the Quran how it is my friend what language what language who is Israel I'm asking you a very That's simple question when you keep when you can when you say to me you see what the point of saying children of Israel is to give me a definition who they are correct I said children of Israel are, are where the most prophets came from Ibrahim, my friend this is not the question Moses. this is not the question you see Muslims you see guys Muslim they no, are they, 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 are, they, they are they are they are people who don't even use their brain look what I'm asking him what the, what the answer I'm saying to you they are saying they are the children of Israel who is Israel I said you there's a clan. There's what a clan? Who is Israel? Israel, Israel, the children of Israel. Israel is a guy, is a man. What a clan. Uh let me uh, give you the answer now. Like, hmm. Give me a second. Okay, search Google. Google peace upon him. We cannot find the answer in the Quran. We find it in Google. Uh they they're the Jews. The the Jews. My friend, know. my friend, everybody knows what Israel Israel is there. Hello, I said Jewish. I, I said mean, you need to be a genius to know what Israel is. the second you say Israel, everybody knows what Israel. This is not a question. The question when your Quran says, Oh, children of Israel, who is the father? Israel, the father is Israel. Who is Israel? I can send you the link because there's a don't send me a link. link. Give me the answer. Who is Israel? You want to call a friend? So what's your answer? Look at this. Uh, look at this. What is your what answer? Is your answer? He's, he want me, Christian Prince. I am a Christian. He is a Muslim. To answer him, to tell him what is Israel in the Quran. This is your book. You yeah, are the one who told me. Knowledge. You are the one who told me the Quran is very no, easy no. to understand. There are some verses are not no. clear. Okay, here we go. I did not ask you about any verse. I ask you about just a word. A word. A word. Israel. What Israel mean? The basic information I know that. The children of Israel were sent by uh, there was their prophet was Moses. That's all I know because in that context in the Quran it talks about the the the, the people who were sent to Moses, Moses, Prophet Musa. My friend, my friend. That's why I said it's a lingu linguistic. I, I my know, friend, my I friend. The, okay, the listen, listen. Linguistic. I do not know. All right. Yeah. Okay. So don't ask me language. No problem. I'm not asking you a language, <laughs> guys. Did I ask you a language? I'm I'm saying to you, who is this guy? Who is this guy, Israel? It's referring to the people that Moses who is, sent. Who is who is he? Who is he? This guy? Who is Israel? Where the name coming from? Who is he? It's a tribe. It's a tribe where the origin where there was okay. people. Okay. Okay. Majority okay. came from that land. All right. All right. Around the Arabian Peninsula. So it's the tribe. It's not a person. Israel is not a person. I said Moses was sent to the Bani Israel. I'm not talking about Moses now. I'm, I'm not talking about Moses. Who is who is Israel? Who is Israel? Look how many places Israel is appearing in the Quran. All of this. Who is Israel? I, I give you my answer. I don't know what you. No, mean. you did not give me the answer. Who is Israel? You are telling me that the, you are telling me his children are tribe. You are telling me there is a children that are tribe. I'm I'm not asking you about the children. I'm saying who is Israel. I don't. That's why I said I do not know the definition exactly. What, it means. what do you mean definition? You ask me definition. Yes, that's why I said. I mean, what, like, no, you, it, it's your Quran saying those are the children of a guy. His name Israel. So shouldn't we know who is Israel? I said the what the point? Know what what the mean. what language? What language? This is about languages. This is about the person, said, regardless yeah. of his name. Let us let us say his name is uh, 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 is Mikael. Let us say his name is Muhammad. Who cares? When you say in the Quran, all oh, children of Muhammad, shouldn't we know who is Muhammad? Who is who is Israel? For argument's sake, I do not know. So, what's your point? Mm, my point is that you are incapable to explain something very simple, even a name in the Quran. You do not know how it came, where it came from. That's I said. I said it's Moses was sent. I do not. I, I don't have. What to know Moses was sent, my friend. Uh, I'm asking. I'm not asking you even about Moses. I'm saying, okay, we have a guy in the Quran. His name is Israel. What? Who is Israel? I know they are from Arabian Peninsula. That's the basic. Arabia, uh, Israel, guys, the basic. guys, Israel from Arabian Peninsula. Did you hear this? Did you hear this? That's why I said hmm. the Jews did not originate. Okay, what do you got? Where do you got this information that Israel is from the Arabian Peninsula? No, no they are from Palestine. Ah, from Palestine. Okay, we changed it now. Okay, from Palestine. 
how his name is how his name is Israel, but he is from Palestine. They're, they're from Palestine, yeah. Well, they, okay. So how, why 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 his name is Israel, but he is from Palestine? And then they moved to Egypt. So that's why uh, around that period. they moved to Egypt. Uh, yes, that's, that's okay, all those verses yeah, you could not yeah, answer anything about them. Yeah. Yeah, ah, okay. Yeah, see, see, guys, see, see the science yeah. and the knowledge. You see the Muslims; they have a lot of knowledge. This Abdul, he prayed to Allah five times, and Allah, he Egypt supplicate him with a lot of knowledge. My, my yeah, friend, my friend, yeah, give me the answer. You got the answer? Somebody text you. Yeah. They are the children of Yaqub. <laughs> Guys, did yes. you hear this? The children of Jacob. Okay, where we can find in the Quran that those are the children of Jacob? Yaqub. How, how do you say it in English? Jacob. Know. Jacob. Yaqub. That's how you say it in, yeah. in, in English. Yeah. It's Yaqub in Arabic. Do you know that? I know that. This is not the question. How we? How you found out that those are the children of Jacob? Yeah, I can give you the link. It's here. It's saying. Uh, the link says that ah, so the Quran so the Quran is a book of funny words have no meaning unless we go and search in Google no that's Yaqub Yaqub is the, is the origin who is Yaqub okay where, where in the Quran it says that Yaqub is Israel show me uh, how his name is Yaqub in the Quran yet the Quran called him the children of Israel how his name changed from Yaqub to Israel Palestine is the, is the land. My and friend, this is another question. Land. This is another question. The guy, his name is Yaqub, Jacob, right? Okay. The Quran mentioned the name of Jacob already. So how Yaqub, you just said to me, Yaqub is Israel, is the same guy. How Yaqub became Israel? What is the story about that? You, you're asking me again definition. I cannot I'm not it. asking you a definition. I'm asking you, you, you just said this guy, his name is Yaqub. How Yaqub is called Israel? Is that a mistake in the Quran? Is his name Jacob or his name is Israel or both? Uh, I have to do more research on that, but but I know they're from Yaqub, so that's my point. I can, your point, I can your say. point is taking it took you a lot to search the internet, and then you came with the conclusion that this is Jacob. Okay, but how we can find, you know, if the Quran is a book of Allah, and Allah is giving us information to teach us about this nation, who the children of Israel. Shouldn't he, tell us, shouldn't, he so tell, shouldn't he tell us? Shouldn't he tell us? Shouldn't he tell us how? Why he is calling him Israel here and calling him Jacob there? What happened? His name we is Jacob. Need, we do not need to know all the details of the Quran. No, we need to know. We need to know. Otherwise, why Allah is sending us the book then? Because our main message is to worship only Allah. No, that's my friend, your message is not only to. You, 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 see, you see, you see. If you, if if Quran if, if it's only Jesus. important to worship Allah, why Allah is telling you about Jacob? That's why I said the Quran is not book of science, it's not book of stories. The it is book of, of stories. What are you talking no, about? Even your God, he report to us no, the no, no. ant speaking to Suleiman. Did you hear let, the story about let, the ant? And, and the objective of the Quran is to guide mankind to so, so that they worship only my Allah friend. What Jesus. mankind? What mankind? You, what mankind? Here we go. How he can guide you, but he could not even guide no, you to tell you book. what kind of it's not. It's a storybook. Everything in this book is a book of stories. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Hello, hello. Do you want me to show you stories in the Quran? The Quran is a book of stories, fiction stories. That's why I said it's not only about stories, part of the answer. Then I'm asking you why Allah missed the point of telling us how the name of Jacob became Israel. There is something missing that's here. That's not the objective. This is the objective. The objective is to tell me about a guy, his name is Israel. His children are children of Israel. How his name is Jacob, but yet we call him the we call them the children of Israel if they are the children of Jacob. How what happened? That's not important to us. how he got the name Israel that's, that's not important I will give you five pesos if you tell me who is the one who gave him the name Israel it's God who chose the name not me who God is the one who named them okay that's okay but his name is Jacob here how what happened how, how Jacob transformed to be Israel what happened that is a story where we can find this story in Islam I said origin the my friend, my friend, the answer is very simple. Your prophet is a thief. He took from the Jews names and he do not know how and what happened. Jacob oh. is a person he was called by God Israel. So the Quran is a book of funny stories which is not connected, disconnected, taking part from here, part from there, and putting the name there, and they mean nothing after that. 
because now there's so no way the, my point is? is my point is your book failed to tell us who is Israel and this is very important how we will so know now how we will know mean? how a Muslim what? will know that Jacob is mr. Israel uh, you mentioned good point let me explain you said that the uh, uh, back days in Medina there used to be a Jewish so the Prophet used to ask them questions about the the knowledge of what will come in the future so mm. you're right there so why the why Allah fail? That's why I said so it means the progressive prophet was sent after generation after generation. So we took knowledge from them, some knowledge. Yeah, he took knowledge, he took he stole names, you know. What took knowledge? Because no, no, he should no, no, he took if knowledge. he took knowledge from them, if he took I, I understand Muhammad took his knowledge from everybody around him. That's why I said as a, as a, okay, us. my friend, my friend, my friend, yeah. my friend. I want you, I want you, uh, 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 Muhammad, Muhammad, you see, yeah. I don't want really to pick up something, let us say, a weak spot about Islam. Can you show me something really solid about Islam to make me believe Islam from God? What do you think, guys? Is that fair? We don't want to pick up uh, uh, things and say, okay, here and there, and this is weak, and this is wrong, and this is a mistake. Show me, choose for me, Mr. Muhammad, a very solid idea. You can prove to us. Uh, and that Muhammad is a prophet and Allah is God choose anything you want here we go I'm listening go ahead uh, you can read surah Samad Ahad surah Samad Wait, what is surah say this uh, this uh, yesterday I explained it it's a funny surah does it make sense did you did you remember when the, the Arab guy who called me about a Samad and we explained uh, it means self-sufficient my friend my friend I said I said to you give me give me something Islam to prove to me if somebody says I am God self-sufficient as you say that this did not prove anything prove to me that Allah is God I can say that too I can say hey Christian Prince I am a Samad I am the only one no one like me brother I have two because eyes the, the rest they have not my I, friend my friend prove to me prove to me that Muhammad is a prophet and Allah is God how you can do that go ahead through the Quran and the prophet like what give me give me an example how you can prove that to me from the Quran if you read the Quran all, all covered I did read the Quran I found it the most funny book here we go I ask you a very simple question about Israel the Quran failed to tell me who is Israel that's why I said that's not the objective of the Quran that, that, no as long as you mention it you need to tell me who is he you don't you cannot you don't throw names there and you say I do not need to tell you who they are if I say to so you right now if I say to you reason? if I say to you now the children of uh, you know uh, uh, Monica Lewinsky shouldn't you ask me who is Monica Lewinsky that's from dunya perspective what dunya perspective he is talking to dunya you are your God Allah speaking to human being we are not gods the second you speak to human beings you speak in their perspective then you explain to them in their perspective we are not gods we know we cannot see what is the unseen so you have to tell us what are you talking about when you see this is how funny you are when I speak to birds, I have to speak the language as simple as that. If I fail to explain to the birds what I am trying to say, it's mean I don't speak their language. It's mean I'm a liar. It's mean I fail. And your God failed to explain himself to us. No, no, no. no. I, I disagree with you, though. My friend, what is he agree? I'm just telling you, show me, show me where Allah he, he, did not, he did not fail. The Quran, all of it is a failure from the beginning to the end. Yeah, according to you, not to me. What according to me? I, I'm challenging you here. You are so with you me life. Me my friend, so aren't you, you with aren't Christian. you with me life now? And I'm challenging you. I'm making a challenge. Says, show me where in the Quran Allah did not fail. Everywhere he failed from the beginning to the end. What about your prophet when when the angel came to him and they squeeze him three times? Do you believe in this story? I give you surah ikhlas. Well, ikhlas mean nothing. It's mean nothing. It's actually it's a mistake because Allah He says, "Say okay. Allah is a khad, and a khad is not one as one member as one as unity." This is a phrase Muhammad took from the Jews, and you are the one who said we took from them knowledge. So the the Bible says, "Oh Israel, your God is a khad." So Muhammad he took it. He put it there in the verse. Ahad is coming from Ahad. Ahad does not mean one. Ah, Ahad means one as unity. This is why the Bible says the man and the wife, or the women, they will be they will get married and they became Ahad. So your God is Ahad is not about one individual. It's about one as unity. 
and the word Tawheed, you Muslim believe in Tawheed, Tawheed does not mean oneness, mean unification. So again, you are you are believing in the Trinity of the Christian without knowing because you you Muslims are ignorant, you are thieves, you stole names, you stole words from other beliefs, and you do not know what they mean. And this is why you do not know what Israel means. If I ask you now, what Isa mean? I don't know the meaning of it. Okay, what Israel mean? That's not the most important. Okay, hold on. What is Jibra what what is Jibrail mean? Jibrail, Gabriel. What Jibrail Gabriel mean? Angel. Gabriel is, is it, my friend. Wake up. Gabriel is the name of the angel. Gabriel. Who? What the name? What the word Gabriel mean? Gabriel is the name of the angel who was. I got it. I got it. Pleasure. It's the name of the angel. You are very smart, but this is not the question. Who is what? When we say Gabriel, we know who is. We are talking about who. I'm saying what is the word mean? I don't know the meaning of it, okay. Well, guys, count with me how many things the Muslim do not know. Very important names. Okay, you do not know Jibreel. What about is Israel? I, I know his, his task, what he did. But okay, but you do not know what the, the word means. Mean. Okay, what Allah mean? What Allah mean? What Allah mean? Me. Allah, Allah, what Allah mean? I, what Allah mean? I do not know the meaning of my friend. What Allah, Allah mean? Allah. Don't tell me that even your God name you do not mean what, but what Allah mean. Allah comes from uh linguistic term that means. You see, you don't know your God name. You don't know what is SS. If you know, you will tell me right away. Allah, uh, uh, is, 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 is. Suddenly, you became like a Morse code. No, Allah means the one who we worship only. The what do you, where, 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 where do you get this from? Allah is a name. Allah is a name. Tell me what the name means. Uh, it's, 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 uh, my, my Arabic is not strong. So uh, but, uh, what does it have to do with your Arabic? You, you know, you see, I don't speak Hebrew. Who told you I speak Hebrew? I can give you that what he does, but I don't know the meaning of what he does. He does nothing, my friend. He controls the affairs of, of his. What Allah lives. mean? What Allah mean? This is what you say to me each time I ask you a question. You say, you know, it says. Okay. You ask me a definition, so I don't know. The I'm not asking you anything. You, you know, you know nothing. You, you know ask nothing. Me definition. Let me see, let me see, uh, guys. If you are only a Muslim, call me. If you are not, don't call me. Only Muslims are welcome to call. Hello. Hello. Yes. Please mute your uh, your uh, YouTube. Hello. Yes, I hear you. Go ahead. All right. Uh, I have a question for you, my friend. Are you a Muslim, my friend? Okay, wait a minute. So, you hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Are you a Muslim? All right. Yes, I'm a Muslim. What what and is what, I, what does it mean to be a Muslim if you don't mind? Wait, wait. Let me let me give you a, a question. Okay. Uh, are you scared? What what was? Is well, I'm really with? scared. Go ahead. I'm listening. Yeah. Uh, you say uh, Jacob is Israel. Is that right? <laughs> you are laughing. Yes, because you are very stupid. You don't know your your own book. Is mm. is Jacob is Israel? Ask, I don't know. You uh, tell me. me. You tell me. You you answer with a counter question? Are my, you my, my friend, Are you my, my friend, my friend. Everybody, yes. everybody is laughing at you, not at me. No, 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 no. Everybody's laughing at you. You uh, cannot answer. Give me an answer. Is Jacob, is he Israel? Who is Jacob then? <clears throat> no, no, no. This is, ask me. You, you, you ask, you answer with a counter uh, question. You, you don't give Ab me an answer. Abdul, is Abdul, Jacob? Abdul, Abdul. No, I'm not Abdul. Listen, is Jacob my my question is very simple. Is Jacob Israel? Yes, or I'm no? really I'm really scared to answer you to be honest with you. Yeah, I know because you are a liar and I caught you in front of your fanboys. You cannot <clears throat> give me an answer and everyone can see it. <laughs> do, do you see how stupid you are? It's your oh, brother who answer. said my it's your brother so who simple. said, let me show you yes. Ab Abdul. Let me show you. Yes. You are stupid like the rest of you. No, no, no! You it's can it's your brother. My, my, you you just got your prophet busted because your prophet busted 
because he is the one who said that Israel is Jacob. No, no, no. I give me an answer. I ask you the, something. Why, you, why you see, I, I, I agree with you that whoever says that he must be stupid as long as he's a Muslim because you're a prophet saying that. Christian Prince, why, why are you free? From are you answer? are you saying that your prophet is a stupid? No, 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 no. You, are you saying? You hold on, hold on. Everybody heard you. 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 Can give me an answer. Everybody heard you. Listen, listen, guys. He said. He said. Whoever believe that Jacob is Israel, he is stupid. This is your opinion, but why no, you I want you to repeat answer? that. I want you, you to repeat that. I want you I to repeat. I want you I to repeat that. Of your, of your I want Everyone you to re I want you Everyone to repeat. I want you to repeat that, please. Uh, you you're not in the position to want anything because you my friend from my answer. friend I made you it clear I, I, I my friend is Jacob Israel yes he is, is he is he is he is. All right, he is right now, and now right as now, long I as, as you. Listen, and, and listen, then as listen. long as it's a stupid that's mean your prophet is a stupid all right all right all right all right this is your opinion listen i caught you and i busted you right now listen exodus chapter 4 verse 22 uh the lord says israel is my son even my firstborn hmm. exodus is the first book <laughs> You got busted in front of your fans. Bye bye, you liar. Do, do you know that you are going to be in YouTube and everybody will be laughing at you? Hello? You don't hang up, you <laughs> let me let me let me search for you where where your prophet is speaking about Jacob, you idiot. You just got your prophet busted if this is true. Yes, Yusuf, how are you? Hello, hello, hello. Hello, my friend. I have a question, yes? No, hold on. Before you go, your friend, uh, your friend, he said Jacob is not Israel. Are you as a Muslim, you agree with him? My friend, I'm not a Muslim. I'm just here to ask questions, yes? No, you are a Muslim. If you are not a Muslim, what do you, what do you think about Muhammad? I have no opinions of him. No, you have opinion. You are a man and you are calling a show about Islam. So you have an opinion. What do you think about? Oh, Muhammad? I have a question about Christianity. No problem. Ask first. You told me you aren't a Muslim. I want to be sure that you are not telling a lie. Oh, okay. Yes, okay. Okay. Go ahead. What do you think of Muhammad? He is a false prophet or true prophet? I have no. I have no opinion of him. You have to give me how opinion. I, how, how can I have opinion of him? Why not? Why not? You have an Arabic name. Your name is Yusuf Amin. Yet you do not know Muhammad. You never heard of Muhammad. I have heard of him. Yes. Okay. So what do you think of Muhammad? I would say he's a good man. He's a good man. Is he a false prophet or a true prophet? A true prophet. See, a second ago you told me you are not a Muslim and you are a liar. No, I'm not a Muslim. Well, you just told me he's a, tr you're, you're, he's a true, true prophet, so you believe in him. Can you prove me wrong? You, I can't prove you wrong. What is the prophecy yeah. of your true prophet? Okay, can I, can I ask you a question now? You see, you call me, you call me denying you're a prophet because you're ashamed of him, my friend. Is that right? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm not religious. You are not religious, but you are a Muslim. No. You, no, are, no, no, you are you are a Muslim. Why? How, how, how do you know this? What do you mean? It's on the front of me. Your name is Yusuf Amin. Yeah, so what? So why you are denying that you are a Muslim? I'm not. You said a second a second a second a second ago you told me that Muhammad is a true prophet. Yes. Okay, that's mean you are a Muslim. No, it doesn't mean I'm a Muslim. Okay, I want you to tell me what a true prophet means. I don't, I, don't, I don't know what it means. Okay, do you be, do you believe in Allah? No, but you I don't, believe in a creator. You don't believe in Allah, so Allah is a liar. No, no, no. So, I never said that. so how you say Muhammad is a true prophet, but wait, he, but you don't wait, believe in Allah? Wait, wait. You, you speak Arabic, right? My friend, don't change the topic. How you believe wait, Muhammad no, you, is? You speak Arabic, right? You don't, speak Arabic. Uh, no, I don't speak. Uh, uh, I, I speak gibberish. Now answer me. How you believe that Muhammad is a true prophet, but yet you don't believe in Allah? In Arabic, what is the name for God? God. Rub, yes, rub, okay. rub, yeah. And what is huh? In question, Arabic Christians, what do they say to what do they call to God? You, you are talking about the translation in the Bible. Who care? You Muslims, no. in, the, in the we read the Quran right now in translation in English, you say Isa is Jesus, I, I but there's Christian no Arab my friend, my friend. No, we don't, I don't believe in Allah. Allah is a fake, stupid God, is not exist. Okay, is Jesus God? I am, and yes, now why you why you deny your prophet? Okay, listen, I have a question for you then. Sure, go ahead. Is Jesus God? 
Sure, the Quran confirmed that. Okay, is Jesus dead? No, he's alive. Where is he? In heaven. Oh, alive in heaven? Hmm? If I go to Wikipedia now, I want to see he's dead. Can you explain this to me? Well, if you go to the Quran, I can show you he's alive. Which one you believe? Okay, Bidya or the Quran? I'm, I'm, I'm not Muslim. I never said that. My friend, are you are you a person who are saying Muhammad is a liar? No, no, no. I never said that. I never said that. Well, the Quran says that Jesus is in heaven. Okay. So, which one you believe? I'm not. وَإِذْ قَالَ اللَّهُ يَا عِيسَى إِنِّي مُتَوَفِّيكَ وَرَافِعُكَ إِلَيْهِ وَمُطَاهِرَكَ مِنَ الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا وَجَاءَ الَّذِينَ اتَّبَعُوكَ فَوْقَ الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا الْيَوْمَ الْقِيَامَةِ So Allah, He says here, He took Jesus to heaven. Are you okay. saying that Allah is lying? Yeah, okay, is Jesus a human? What's Jesus? My friend, human? don't change the topic. You ask me a question, let's finish it. Why, why you jump like a monkey? Why you jump like a monkey? <laughs> a second ago, you said to me, if you go to Wakabidia, you will find that Jesus is dead. Yes. Okay, the Quran says that Jesus is alive. Why are you are making fun of Allah? Oh, I told you. I told you I'm not religious. It doesn't matter if you are religious or not. So now, do you, do you swallow your tongue and you apologize to Allah that Jesus is in heaven or you still insist that Jesus is not in heaven? No, oh, you told me should I believe the Quran or not? My friend, my friend, this is not the question. Are you willing to apologize from the Prophet Muhammad that he is telling the truth and Jesus now in heaven, or is still you don't believe in Muhammad telling the truth? My religious. What religious mean? Do I do I believe in the religion? You the see, I, I have no time for a stupid talk. Go. Yeah. Let your dad call me. When I showed him that the Quran says that Jesus is in heaven, now he don't want to talk about it no more. He wants change the topic. And the other donkey who called me says to you, I got you busted. I got you busted, Jacob. Jacob is not Israel. If I show you now your prophet saying that, what you will do? You will cry like a baby. Don't call me, kid. Only if you are brave enough, you deny your prophet, yet you don't dare to talk about your prophet. Hello? Yeah, hello. How are you, my friend? Yeah, I'm okay. And you? Do you agree with the Muslims who called me a second ago? He said Jacob is not Israel. Yeah, the, yeah. The problem is that you, you are very rude. You don't listen to no one to talk. Mm -hmm. You are very, very rude. Let me ask you: When your prophet he said the Christians and Jews are pigs and monkeys, he was rude. I'm trying to tell you that you you don't give people to my friend my friend how talk. come you don't find that Muhammad is rude when he calls us the you worst of the creature you when you call people Africa. kuffar you see you don't, you don't you don't you, 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 you see Christian look let me show you how hypocrite you are I'm how you follow a man he called names to everybody around him and he killed them you see he just said the effort did you hear it man. guys did you say again say again say again he just said the effort he is he is saying I am rude and he just said to me the effort praise be to Allah the second you get them busted, they are calling you rude. You're a prophet, call us pigs, monkeys, kuffar, nudges, filthy, dirty, worth of the worst of the creatures. And I did not call you any of those names. Coward liar. Coward and a liar. If we go in the Quran now and see what Allah he called the Christians and what Muhammad called the Christians you will see all kind of disgusting filthy words what if I call you najis Muslims as Muhammad he called us hmm? is that rude najis mean filthy more than the sewage and you call me to say the effort and this is additional proof that Islam is a stupid false religion. The same as the guy who called me to say to me, Christian Prince, are you saying that Jacob is Israel? The second I say to him, what if I show you your prophet saying so? He hang up like a potato. Who's next? <laughs> Christian Prince, I got you busted, Christian Prince. I got you busted. Are you saying that Jacob is Israel by Christian Prince? Christian Prince? Stupid people. Can you find me one of them is smart? Can you? Hello? Hello, Christian Prince. Yes, my friend. Uh, you know, uh, I just uh, watching your video and uh, <laughs> I really shocked about 
how much stupid Muslims, you know. Okay. What else you want to say? Uh, I want to say to every Muslim that Jesus is Lord and you should obey to him and, and to to be a Christian. All right. Thank you, my, my friend, for call. Let us see if we can get some Muslims here. Okay. Thank you. Guys. All right. All right. Thank you. You see, when Muslims, they speak, they speak out of knowledge. They have no idea what they're talking about. Hello? 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 Okay, if you don't want to talk, please hang up. Uh, call me back, please. Sheikh Tala. <coughs> hello? Yes, hello? Yes, my friend. How are you doing? I'm fine. What do you think I about What do you think about your brother? He said that uh, Yaqub or Jacob is not Israel. Um why don't you get the answer from your bible from genesis 32 22 to 32 well you can read for us tell us I mean, he's saying that uh, that he changed his name into israel right right okay so why your brother he's saying that whoever believe in that is a stupid i'm just saying you got the answer my friend no uh, i do not get the answer <clears throat> my friend I, i'm making a point here your brother, he said that Israel is not Jacob. And he's saying he got me busted. So do you think he is the one is being stupid or you think he is just a kid? Do you agree? Um, do you I, agree that Israel is Yaqub in the Quran or he is a different person? He, he's the same person. He's the same person. And even your prophet said that, correct? I'm telling you he's the same person. Yeah, but your prophet, he said that, right? I'm telling you, he's. The same I know person. you are telling me he is the same person. I'm saying, did your prophet can say we, that too? We agreed upon something. Can we move on? No, no, no yeah, yeah, no problem, no problem. No. But let us finish it. You agree? Did your prophet tell you that Israel is Jacob? Yes or no? I said, go in your. I go. I. I'm going by your Bible, my friend. By if I ask you the question to you, then if I ask you, you. How you know that Israel is Jacob? How you how you will tell me who is who is Jacob? Who is Israel? How you tell me? Go ahead, tell me. How you learn you yourself that Israel is a guy who is you his name used to be Jacob? How you know that? Because Allah told me in the Quran where that that the can you listen please? Yeah, Let I'm listening. Finish. Listening. Go ahead. Where he told you? Allah told me hmm. to believe in every book. That was revealed by him, and the Bible is one of those. So you are saying today, you Muslims cannot be, cannot cannot be Muslim without believing in the Torah and the and the Injil. Oh, absolutely. Okay. So so how so how you say how you claim that the Torah and the Injil are corrupt? Okay. My friend. So so how so how you want to believe in a book which is corrupt? Aren't you saying that the Torah is corrupt? Allah is telling me what is not corrupt. What, yes, how he told corrupt. you? How he told you that Israel is Jacob and this is not corrupt? Go ahead. I said, uh, uh, listen to me. Hmm. Um, there is no discussion. There is no debate on that. Why? You know why? There is no conflict on Jacob and israel you know that and i know that now, how we will know my, my friend my, you listen to me i don't know we don't want to talk at the same time I'm, I'm talking to you as an adult friendly and nicely you as a muslim yes. how we will find out that jacob is israel you say to me you go back to the torah correct correct okay but the torah is a corrupt book isn't it according to islam some part is correct okay how yes. you know how you know how you know that that name there of Jacob to be Israel is the story there is not a corrupt story did that he make fun did that he made fun of that story did that himself he made fun of this story about how Jacob his name changed so how did that he made fun of that story but yet you believe in that story which one of you is telling a lie 
uh, 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 I already answered, I told you anything that was not correct, Allah corrected it. Where he corrected Allah it? Where he corrected it? Where, 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 where he corrected it? Where, where he corrected it? Where he corrected it? Corrected what? Where he corrected that the name of Israel, where he told you that Israel, where he told you that the Jews, they are telling you the true name of Israel, that is this is Jacob, where he said that in the Quran. Do you understand English? I said, if something is not correct in the Bible, hmm. Allah will correct the Quran. It's hmm. anything that is correct in the so Bible, if any, leave it So wrong. if anything is not mentioned in the Quran against the, the Bible, Allah, he approved it, correct? Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Guy, did you hear this? Anything, anything. Yep. Okay, so so anything is is in the Bible. In in the Bible, the Quran did not speak against. Must be true. Most of it is. All right. So let me ask you a question then. Where we can find in the Torah that the Jews they worship a guy his name is Uzair. Why why you asking the question? You are the one who said that the Quran correct the Torah and the Torah is if there is something wrong there he corrected Okay, the Quran says that Uzair ibn, ibn Allah Uzair is a guy the Jews worship they call him that he is the son of Allah where we can find Uzair which Allah is correcting in the Torah Oh, so did I say that anything else is correction my did friend my friend yes yes you said anything else is a correct correct okay that's mean there's no, 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 no. that that's mean that's mean that's mean that in the Torah now we should have a verse says that the Jews worship a guy his no. name is Uzair no every no everybody that, that listen that got a brain knows that I'm telling you you are the one who told me you are the one who told me that anything in the Torah Allah corrected anything he did not mention it it's me it's correct okay show me where Allah he correct the verse and where we can find the verse that the Jews worship a guy his name is Uzair who's Uzair what you would have told me was this never been spoken in the Torah it doesn't mean that anything else is from the Torah my friend it doesn't mean my friend the Jews the Jews, the Jews believe, hmm, my friend, my friend, no, I don't, no, I don't have a brain. I gave it to Muhammad so he can extend the size of your penis. Now, let us fix this. You can answer to Muhammad, whatever you do. My friend, now, my friend, where is Uzair? Where is the, where is the guy? His name is Uzair. Where we can find him in the Torah. In the Torah. So God does not need to, to fix it. It says about something else. No, it's fixed. Yeah, it. He says the Jews they say that Uzair is son of Allah. Who is Uzair? Son of who? Allah. Yes, the son of Allah. The Quran says that. He said that the Jews they worship a guy. His name is Uzair. He is the son of Allah. Who is Mr. Uzair? The Quran said that's what they said. The Quran didn't say that. that Absolutely. Is, and you are the one who said to me anything is wrong in the Torah. You are the Why one who said, lying? Abdul, you are the one who said anything in the Torah, Allah corrected. If Allah, and I said to you, so are you saying that anything Allah did not mention, it's me correcting the Torah? You said yes. So only the wrong things, the Quran is correcting it. Okay. The Quran saying that the Jews worship a guy, his name is Uzair. Where we can find Mr. Uzair? That is not a correction from the Torah. That is a new information Allah is giving us. That the Jews information about it. what? Information about who? Who is Uzair and who is the Jew who worship a guy? His name is Uzair. Did you see in the Did you see in the uh, in the Torah that, for example, uh, uh, you think Allah going to correct something that hasn't been speaking? Allah correct what you, what was wrong in the Torah and then talk tell us about other stories. About the Jews, <laughs> okay. What Allah, He correct the Jews, my friend. You are the one who said to me, Allah is speak to correct anything. Allah, He correct in the Torah. It's mean this is corrupt. Anything Allah did not speak against, it's not corrupt. That's what you said, correct? Yeah. Okay. Yes. So when Allah He said Uzair is a son of Allah, the Jews they believe in that. It's mean He's correcting them based on your your definition. Where we can find where we can find in the Jews religion, anyone who heard of a guy, his name is Uzair, who worship Allah. And he worshipped the son of Allah. His name is Uzair. Okay. Uh, I know the world is listening, right? Mm. Here's what I said clearly. Mm. Li guys, listen to CP, Christian, uh, uh, whatever you call his name. is. I, I told him, <clears throat> anything that is wrong in the Torah, I'm repeating it loud. Mm. Anything that is, uh, that is wrong in the Torah, Allah is going to correct it. Mm. If nobody talks about Ezra, I said everything they say that is not right, that is wrong, Allah is going to fix it in the Quran. Hmm. If they don't talk about it, how can be Allah fixing it? Allah is giving other information 
about that we do not know about Israelis. My friend, 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 I ask you, I ask you how you know about Jacob. I ask you how you know about Jacob. You said you go to the book of Genesis, correct? Okay. I asked you why you believe in the book of Genesis. He said because Allah, uh, he, uh, the, uh, he told me that this is we have to go by the old books came before us I said but isn't it corrupt you said yes but not all of it if, if, if there's any corruption yeah. happened Allah spoke against it in the Quran so now Allah speaking about yeah. the corruption of the Jews he said that the Jews yeah. call Uzair the son of Allah and the Christian they call Christ the son of Allah okay that's wonderful yeah. so now where we can find the Jews calling Uzair the son of Allah can you find me one Jew believe in this garbage uh, let me repeat you again, uh, guys. Can, uh, you, I think you have a problem. You have a serious problem. I tell you, anything they say, they wrote in the Bible. If it is not correct, Allah is gonna correct it. Whatever they wrote, if they write it in the Bible, Allah gonna correct it. So if they say that Jesus died in the Bible, Allah said, no, you did not kill him. That's wonderful. See, Allah fixes. It. That's wonderful. Okay, okay now, now Allah, the, now Allah, he said. Now Allah, he said, Uzair is the son of Allah. He's correcting that. Where we can find that in the book of the Jews? Can I see? It, it does not mean that anything else. It, the, the Quran, the, the Quran is not just to fix the Bible. It's to fix the Bible. It tell us other things. Oh, I, you, you will not find my friend, my friend. I got, I got your point. Allah is fixing the Jews too, fixing the book of the Jews. The Jews they corrupt their book according to you, and they call a guy. His name is Uzair. Where we can find Uzair in the son in the, in the book of the Jews? Where the Jews believe that there's a guy. His name is Uzair, and he is the son of Allah. Oh my God! I, that's what I'm telling you. Allah is not fixing that. Allah is telling us this uh, is not in the Bible. Is it in the Bible? It's it, not. It is not. So Allah is not fixing that. It is not so because it's a lie. Because it's a lie. Because it's a lie. Okay, now, now let's talk about Jesus. You said Jesus is dead, right? You said you said the Quran said Jesus is dead. No, no, no I said he's not dead. No, I said Jesus in the Quran. He is alive. He is in heaven. The, your your friend. He said if I go to Wakabidia, Jesus is dead. It's you, Muslim, who said that, not me. No, Allah said that. Why are you lying? Allah said Jesus is. He terminated Jesus' life in this earth. Okay, he did not kill him. He, ter he terminated. My friend, my friend, yes. you see, you are deaf like the rest of you. It's your brother, the Muslim, he said, if I go to Wakabidia, I found that Jesus is dead. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's your brother. His okay. name is, is Yusuf. He is the one he said that according to Wakabidia, Jesus is dead. He said that, not me. I said to him, no. no. I said to him, no. Jesus, your brother, a Muslim guy, a Muslim guy, he called me before you. He said that. He said, if you, you go to Wakabidia, hold on, hold on. You this let me talk you're a brother he called okay. me before you and he said yeah. if he if he said he I'm said to me is jesus is alive i said yes he said well how come if i go to work i find him dead i said well that, are you saying that the quran lie and then he hung up because i showed him the quran saying that allah he took him up to heaven do you agree with that allah took him up to heaven after terminating after terminating his life how he terminated his here. life and explain to us that. explain to us how allah terminated how? How? In 350, he said, Oh, Jesus, hmm. I am terminating your life, raising you up to me, hmm. and riding and, and, and reading you hmm. of the disbeliever hmm. till the day of resurrection. Hmm. Okay. That is okay. 355. I know that. And I know five, that, my friend. I know that. <laughs> the question is when you say he terminated his life, what does that mean exactly? Just explain to us. To me, it's life. You uh, do you know? Uh, do you know what the what the, do you know the difference between the body and the soul? My friend, just tell me. Do you know that. Don't give me a speeches. Tell me what do you mean by terminate his life? That means Jesus died. Died. Thank you very much, God. Did you hear this? That's mean Jesus yes. died. Okay. So why must they say yeah. no? He did not die. Allah took him. He's alive. I don't care. No, Allah said you did not kill him. Hmm, but Allah but, didn't say he didn't die. He said to the Jews, "You did not kill him." Okay, but, but, he didn't but, die. He, but he died. But he died. You said he died. No, but where not he, because of the, okay, where he died? Not, where, not, where he died? How he died? Who who cares? No, we care. This is Jesus. Hello, <laughs> who cares? <laughs> you need to tell us. Okay, how many minutes before Allah He take him to heaven? He made him die. So, are you saying to me that Allah made him die and then He go to heaven and then resurrected him there? Okay, how about that? How about you tell me? Do you know how? Do you know how Hitler died? Hitler. Do you know how he died? 
you are comparing Jesus to Hitler? I'm just telling you. Do you know how he died? A lot, a millions of people die. Nobody knows how they die. My friend, a lot to my, 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 my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You Muslims, you, you Muslims are, are, net, are network of lying because many Muslims they said to me before, many Muslims they said to me before that Jesus did not die. Allah took him up to heaven directly. You are saying to me the opposite. You are saying no. He made him die first. He made him die. Let me ask you, what is your sect? What is your sect? What is your sect? I said uh, he did not die. I have no sex. He did not die at the cross. They said they killed him. Okay, so he, he died. Said, he died after, after uh, uh, but not in the cross, right? But not in the cross. Okay. Allah what is what is your proof. what is your proof? My proof is is in is a Quran four one fifty seven to one fifty nine. My friend, they never killed my, him. Okay, hold no, on, hold on. They didn't crucify him. Hold on, they hold were on. made to think that they did. Hmm. Let me let me show you the verse, my friend, and and let us love together. Let us love together. Let us love together. Hmm? You see, chapter four, chapter four, verse one fifty seven. Chapter four, verse one fifty seven. What translation you like me to read for you? I said I don't care what you read. I'm telling you. I'm not telling you about what translation. translation what translation you accept? What the translation you are reading for me from? You, you. When you read, you read what translation? Yes. Who? Who cares? Really okay, who cares? No problem. Guys, who cares? I mean, well, I'm not going to waste my time. I'm trying to be nice to you. Okay, read with me carefully. They say in both that we killed Jesus, the son of Mary, the messenger of Allah, but they killed him not, nor crucified him, but it was so was made appear to them. Do you agree with that? Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Guys, listen to this carefully. This guy, he agreed that there was a person who looked exactly like Jesus on the cross. I never, I never said that. I never said that. Well, he says appear, never, appeared, appeared to them. What does that mean? What does that? What does that mean? Uh, it okay. was made to appear to them. You can ask that, but don't make me don't don't, don't put words in what? my mouth. Okay, what you, what you is can. that mean? Explain. Go ahead. Go, go ahead. Go ahead. Make me go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. You ask questions. You don't assume things. I'm not assuming. I am not assuming. This is what all your scholars agree upon. Do you want me to get you busted? Ask me. Ask me. Why don't you can ask me? I am asking you, and I'm assuming that you know what the scholars say. Are you saying that your prophet is a liar too? Because you're a prophet who told the Muslims that. You're a prophet who told them that Allah, he cloned someone look like Jesus. Allah said, Yes, there are hypocrites within Muslims. Oh, the, the Muslims are yeah. hypocrites and they are telling a lie. Okay, what is your lie? Tell us your lie. Tell us your Just lie. Just listen to me. Me, hmm. don't don't tell me what. You, don't put word in my mouth. Okay, so you ask me what was made appear to them mean. Now, okay, now I, I'm a, I'm gonna I'm a give you an answer uh -huh. from the Bible. Uh -huh. Okay. Hmm. Now I want you to go to to Matthew twenty seven uh -huh. seventeen. Hmm. Go to Matthew twenty seven seventeen hmm. on the revised standard on the revised Bible hmm. on the revised on the on the original. He said, "What does it say?" It says. When the pilot came, when they got Jesus, put him in prison, right? They put Jesus in prison, and there was another man called Jesus, the Barabbas. Hmm. Who was Jesus, the Barabbas? There was two people called, but that's why I asked you yesterday that, that question. Hmm. There was two men called Jesus in that jail, hmm. and the wife, the wife of the pilot, hmm. said, "The pilot, do not kill that good man. Hmm. Don't deliver him to them bad people." Hmm. And the pilot asked. Hmm. Who do you want me to deliver you? Uh -huh. Is this Jesus hmm. Barabbas hmm. or Jesus called Christ? Hmm. They said Jesus, the so-called Christ. Hmm. He delivered Jesus Barabbas. It's in your own Bible. <laughs> so, but which one they crucify, my friend? They crucified Jesus Barabbas. Where it says that, my friend, they crucify all of them, my friend. They crucify everybody was there. However, however, listen, they crucify everybody knows. You, you see, you just you just destroy your Quran. You just destroy your you just destroy the Quran. You just destroy the Quran. This is how stupid you are. Because if they if they crucify a guy, his name is Barabbas. That's mean the Quran is lying. The Quran is lying then because the Quran says made to appear to them, appear to them, which means they saw someone look exactly like Jesus. If I change the name if let us say hold on shut up idiot shut up if there's 10 guys their name is muhammad still there's one person he looked like muhammad yes okay jesus Barabbas. he looked exactly Barabbas. like jesus he looked exactly like jesus the one they want to crucify 
Nobody said it looked like Jesus. My friend, my friend, like my Jesus. friend, the Jews, the Jews, all of them, they knew how Jesus looked like. The Jews, they witnessed his miracle by thousands. He was speaking to them. He was witnessing to them. He was preaching them. He spoke to them in the mountain. He spoke to them in Jerusalem. He spoke to them in Bethlehem. He spoke to them everywhere. So how the Jews, they will be fooled by a guy just because his name is Jesus. Are you stupid or what? Uh, uh, in your own Bible, they say, "Did we really kill Jesus the Barabbas?" They ask him themselves a question. My friend, my friend, my my friend, my friend, you are a foolish man because the same book you are reading saying tens of time that Jesus was crucified. I said, uh, "Listen to me." In your own Bible, it is saying that they have doubt who did they kill really. In your own Bible, where where it says they they have a doubt about who they killed Larry. Show me where it says that. Go ahead and prove. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, my friend, Go my friend, my friend, my friend. Are you saying? It? Oh, hold on, 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 hold on. Don't don't scream, don't scream, don't scream, don't scream, don't scream, don't scream. Take it easy, take it easy. Does it? Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Did the book? Did the book of Matthew? You said the book of Matthew, right? Yes. Okay. In the book of Matthew, the book of Matthew. Did the book of Matthew speak and confirm that Jesus was crucified? I said, did the book of Matthew starting... My friend, I'm asking you, I'm asking you, I'm asking you how many times and you repeat. What's wrong with you? In the book of Matthew, in the book of Matthew, in the book of Matthew, what's wrong with you? How many times the book of Matthew confirmed that the one who was crucified is Jesus? Matthew, mm -hmm. I said the people are asking themselves, who did we kill? Yeah, so the pilot had so a who we will kill, 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 but they killed Jesus. No, no, do you know? Do you know open do you with know me, do you open know? with me. Don't be don't be a foolish man. All the Christians, the book of Matthew is in the front of us. People are laughing at you. People are laughing at you. Let me let, let me hang up on you and call me after I play this this chapter. And so everybody can hold on, hold on. Call me back after I play this. I will show everybody how stupid you are and what you are saying and how silly it is. You Muslims are very confused and you are going against your own Quran. Muslims are the most funny, stupid people ever I met in my life when they try to explain to us their book and our book. They do not know what their book mean. They do not know what our book mean. When I say to him, the scholars of Islam, they say so, he said, they are murafiqun, they are liars. You are the liar too. You are no different. This is the book of Matthew. Matthew 27. When the morning was come, all the chief priests and elders of the people took counsel against Jesus to put him to death. And when they had bound him, they led him away and delivered him to Pontius Pilate, the governor. Then Judas, which had betrayed him, when he saw that he was condemned, repented himself and brought again the thirty pieces of silver to the chief priests and elders, saying, I have sinned, and that I have betrayed the innocent blood. And they said, What is that to us? See thou to that. And he cast down the pieces of silver in the temple, and departed, and went, and hanged himself. And the chief priest took the silver pieces and said, It is not lawful for to put them into the treasury, because it is the price of blood. And they took counsel, and bought with them the potter's field to bury strangers in. Wherefore that field was called the field of blood unto this day. Then was fulfilled that which was spoken by Jeremy the prophet, saying, And they took the thirty pieces of silver, the price of him that was valued, whom they of the children of Israel did value, and gave them for the potter's field, as the Lord appointed me. And Jesus stood before the governor, and the governor asked him, saying, Art thou the king of the Jews? And Jesus said unto him, Thou sayest. And when he was accused of the chief priests and elders, he answered nothing. Then said Pilate unto him, Hearest thou not how many things they witness against thee? And he answered him to never a word, insomuch that the governor marveled greatly. Now at that feast... The governor was wont to release unto the people a prisoner whom they would. And they had then a notable prisoner called Barabbas. Therefore when they were gathered together, Pilate said unto them, Whom will ye that I release unto you, Barabbas or Jesus, which is called Christ? For he knew that for envy they had delivered him. When he was set down on the judgment seat, his wife sent unto him, saying, Have thou nothing to do with that just man? 
for I have suffered many things this day. And so you see, guys, how they lie. The ruler he said, Which one you want me to free for you? This person or this person, and the verses says it clear who is the one who was afraid. Very stupid of you, very naive of you, and you are being a donkey like the rest of you. And not only that, you are making mockery of the Quran. He's making mockery of the Quran and even the, 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 the story told by Muhammad himself. How are you, Hassan? Hassan, are you there? And even the, 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 the story told. Hello? Yeah, hello? Mute, uh, mute the YouTube, please. Yeah, hello, hello? Okay, mute the YouTube. YouTube. Okay, mute the YouTube. Okay, go ahead. I'm not. I'm not going to waste my time asking you to mute YouTube. Hello. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, Christian Prince. Okay, my Tell friend. Me. Let me ask you a question. Do you agree with this guy saying? Is it true? Is it true what the Quran says that Allah He cloned or Muhammad said that Allah He cloned someone look like Jesus or you don't agree? Allah said, Allah said that He switched Jesus Christ with somebody else. Okay, so He switched, so He cloned. It's not somebody. Yeah, it's, it's not. It's not what this guy is saying. He, not, ma he, he made someone look like Jesus, correct? He made someone. He, he made someone look like Jesus, correct? Okay, so you believe. Okay, okay, so you believe. So you believe God died. You believe God? No, we no, God. no, we don't believe anyone can kill yes. God. Nobody can kill God. Nobody. No, no, nobody can kill. Dead. Nobody can but kill God. No, no, God. no. They kill, they kill the flesh. The killed. They kill the, the. They kill the man. The flesh of the man. Nobody can kill God. God is always alive. <laughs> let me ask you okay, a question. Let, let, let me let me let me laugh at you Tell too. Me let, me laugh at you. let me laugh at you. Let me laugh. Let me let me laugh at you. Let me laugh at you. Just just, just to show you that your Muslims are a bunch of ignorant. Isn't it your prophet who said the one who 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 was killed? He is alive. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Did okay. your prophet say you that the that one who Jesus is killed Christ, for us? Did your prophet say, don't say, shout, don't shout, don't why, shout, why don't shout, don't shout? Did your, did your prophet say the one who died as a murderer, he is oh, alive, he is oh, not dead? So yes or no? Look, yes or no? Yes, yes or no? Yes, yes, yes or no, yes. Abdul? Yes or no? The one who died as a murderer. The one who died as a murderer, he is alive. Are you accusing your prophet to be a liar? Listen to me. Are you accusing your prophet to be well, a liar? Chapter two, uh, verse one fifty four. Chapter two, I, verse number one fifty four. Just set up. Read with me carefully, guys. Those Muslims are making fun of their book. Don't speak to me with respect. I will hang up on you. I'm, I don't have to talk to you. This is your prophet saying that the one who they are killed, and this is not Jesus, just a normal Muslim, the one who is killed as a murderer. You think they are dead, but the fact they are alive, and you don't know. Are you accusing your prophet to be a liar? Chapter 2, verse number 154. If this has happened to a normal Abdul, what will happen to someone he is not? He is like Jesus. Hello? Yes. What do you say about your prophet saying that those who die and killed for the sake of Allah, they are alive? Do not say. He said, "Do not say that they are dead." Do not say. It. I'd ask you earlier. Do you make a difference? Do you know that the soul never dies? Do you know that? Barnaba, you don't know that. Barnaba, Barnabas. Yeah, they killed the Messiah. No. They killed the Messiah, my friend. Why didn't you read to them that this this part, this section you read? The, uh, uh, you you start reading. Uh, my, my, uh, my, uh, my friend, my friend. Let me play for you again. Who, don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Show me where there in that verses it says that they, they let they let the true Jesus leave and they crucify the wrong one. Show me where it says that. He said he said those those who thought the killer are full of doubts. They're full of doubt of who the key in your own what Bible. What doubt? What doubt? What are you talking about? I do read for me. Let us love together. Let us love together. Let us love together. Let us love to let us live, let us live, let us love together. What verse you are reading from? 
Okay, hold on, let me read it for you. What, 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 what verse? What verse? What verse? You just put it out there. You just put what it out verse? What verse? What verse? Told you Matthew 27. 17 and following verses. Okay. That's all I can tell you. Let me, let me play it for you again. Shut up. Let us play it again. I will play it for you again. Hold on. Here we go. Okay. Then was fulfilled that which was spoken by Jeremy the prophet, saying, And they took the thirty pieces of silver, the price of him that was valued, whom they of the children of Israel did value, and gave them for the potter's field, as the Lord appointed me. And Jesus stood before the governor, and the governor asked him, saying, Art thou the king of the Jews? And Jesus said unto him, Thou sayest. And when he was accused of the chief priests and elders, he answered nothing. Then said Pilate unto him, Hearest thou not how many things they witness against thee? Yes. And he answered him to never a word, insomuch that the governor marveled greatly. Now at that feast, the governor was wont to release unto the people a prisoner whom they would, and they had then a notable prisoner called Barabbas. Therefore, when they were gathered together, Pilate said unto them, Whom will ye that I release unto you, Barabbas or Jesus, which is called Christ? For he knew that for envy they had delivered him. When he was set down on the judgment seat, his wife sent unto him, saying, Have thou nothing to do with that just man? For I have suffered many things this day in a dream because of him. But the chief priests and elders persuaded the multitude that they should ask Barabbas and destroy Jesus. The governor answered and said unto them, Whether of the twain will ye that I release unto you? They said, Barabbas. Pilate saith unto them, What shall I do then with Jesus which is called Christ? They all say unto him, Let him be crucified. And the governor said, Why? What evil hath he done? But they cried out the more, saying, let him be crucified. When Pilate saw that he could prevail nothing, but that rather a tumult was made, he took water and washed his hands before the multitude, saying, I am innocent of the blood of this just person. See ye to it. Then answered all the people and said, His blood be on us and on our children. Then released he Barabbas unto them. And when he had scourged Jesus, he delivered him to be crucified. Then the soldiers of the governor took Jesus into the common hall, and gathered unto him the whole band of soldiers, and they stripped him. All right, that's enough. So did you see it, my friend, or why are you are lying? Hello? Uh, you want to show the good thing, when he says, and those who thought they killed him are full of doubts. Why don't you my show friend, that? My friend, I, 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 I have no time. What no. doubt? What no. doubt, you stupid? Get lost. What? The, the, the verse in the front of me, the verse in the front of me, we play for you everything there. This is the verses. What, what are you talking about? They, he said there clearly that they crucified Jesus. They insist we want Jesus the Christ. Which one you want? You want Barnabas or you want Jesus? And the guy, he washed his hand from the blood of Jesus because simply don't call me Hassan now. Hassan, don't call me. What's wrong with this, Abdul? Just wait, wait. Let me answer the other guy, Hassan. Just wait. Have, have patience. He said, I wash my hands from his blood. Why? Because that's it. He's an innocent man. Why he's washing his hands? Because the decision is made. Because he have to do what they want. They knew who is his, who is this guy, and who is this guy. You see how stupid you are? He is asking them, which one you want? It's meaning they know them both. You cannot fold them. He said, which one you want? Jesus the Christ? Or Barabbas. <laughs> That's me and the crowd. They knew exactly each one of them very well. He said to them, but this person, he do nothing wrong. Hello? Uh, hello. Yes, Hassan, how are you? Uh, let me explain the origin of Ben Israel. Oh, you, you get the answer now, the origin of the Israel, okay. Uh, I, yes, I was ignorant about it. Okay, good, good. Go ahead. So, so the origin comes from we agreed Yaqub. Mm. So Yaqub had many children. Okay. And then they were origin from Palestine, where they call Canaan. Canaan. Mm -hmm. How do you say Canaan? Okay, no problem. Go ahead. 
Canaan. So the other name of the synonym of Canaan is Palestine, or you can call it Israel. So that's why they are called Bani Israel, the children of Israel. Yeah, but that's why but the name came. But my friend, this is not my question to you. The question was, how you as a Muslim you will know that Israel is this guy? Like now you get this information, but not from the Quran. No, we affirm it from the Quran. From the Quran, you found it. No, no, no. The Quran okay. doesn't. So take, uh, this, no, this, no. I said the Quran doesn't tell yeah, so all this, the details. This I'm saying the Quran, if it's a book from God, shouldn't be complete and tell us who is this guy we call, etc. How you name, want to know why? How his name changed? How his name changed? You know why the you story need is to not know there? Why? Okay, why? Uh, because the uh, the Prophet told us that do not believe everything the old scriptures say. Just take the what's the narration, authentic narration. You take it. If it's fabrication, you reject. No it. So problem. No problem. So now, how how you will know? Okay, if he is he is saying to you, don't take. He's giving you the option yeah, yeah, to take whatever us. you want. No, no. He gave us permission. He said. No problem. Uh, okay, he took now that the guy. His name yeah. is Israel. Okay, how Muhammad he he took that and how his name became Israel. Shouldn't he tell us? No, because. You remember the Jews lived with him during that time in the crash line. My friend, but I don't they care. Just if they, questions. they don't care if they live. No, nobody is asking question. Muhammad is saying things. Nobody is asking him. When the no, Jews, no, they, they used to ask they, him questions. Okay, uh, they ask him a question, but the question they ask and him, then, the, the question the, they the ask question him, they are, the, my friend, the, uh, the question the Jews ask Muhammad always get Muhammad busted. He do not need. No, no, no. He, he didn't know. Need. Yes, yes. Okay, let, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Uh, What's your point now? I don't understand. To be honest, I explained my part. Okay. So what's your point? Uh, the Jews they ask Muhammad questions. You are right, but they did not ask him to learn from him. No, they used to learn. No, no, we used to learn lessons from the stories. Of really, the they Jews. used to learn lessons, or they make fun of him. No, no lessons. Lessons. You mean life lessons, like mm. parables? You know, we used to get knowledge from them, but not hundred percent. Okay. Because well, that's. Let, let us see. Let, we let use us oral see. tradition. You know, oral tradition. As I know, as I know, the Jews they came to Muhammad. They used to ask him questions. Yes. Uh, the Jews they came to Muhammad and they asked him questions. Let us see if they asking questions. Uh, uh, to Not all times. No problem. Some, yeah. Sometimes. Uh, uh, they ask him questions, but we want to see if they ask him questions to know or to make fun of him and get him uh, busted. No, no. Let me state one point. Let me can can you allow me to talk, please? Mm. You know the six the six articles of faith. We have to believe all the books. You know that in, in, in as a Muslim. How you gonna believe in the books if you don't have the books? That's why I said if it's authentic, we take okay. it. If it's I want fabrication, you, Hassan, do, do you see my screen with me? Uh, uh, I no, want, no, I can't see. I want you to you, look, yeah. I want you to look at the screen, please. This Hello? Is, this is Sahih Hadith. Do you see the screen? Yeah. Okay. Uh, a guy, he came to Muhammad and supposed he present the Jews and he asked him a question. Saying, he said to Muhammad, I want to ask you about the three things which nobody knows unless he is a prophet. Do you know the story? He was a Jewish man, yeah? Yeah, a Jewish man. He said to him, I want to yes. ask you three things which nobody knows unless he is to be a prophet. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, I know. Okay, firstly, what is the first portent of the hour? What is the first meal of the people in paradise? And what make the baby look like its father or mother? So this is the question that Jews, they ask Muhammad to know is a prophet. Do you think this is really a story? This is how you know a prophet or not? Or this is just a guy is making fun of Muhammad and he is a hypocrite, you know, trying just to... Or this is... Story. No, they used to test him. Okay, so they, they used to thank you very him. much. They are testing him, guys. Did he say it? You said they, they are testing, testing him. him okay, if let, us see, real let us see if your Muhammad failed the test or he was succeed. The prophet said, Just now, just now, Gabriel has informed me about that. Just now, he received a message. <laughs> that guy asked him a question right away. Muhammad, he received a message. Abu Abdullah said, Gabriel, he said, Yes, Abdullah said, He is among the angels, is the enemy of the Jews. Is that true? Is that is Jibreel is the enemy of the Jew? At that time, yes. That's a big fat lie. I challenge anyone to show me where the Jews. No, they hate I God. said at that time. What at that time? This is funny, man. Why the Jews? They would hate Jibreel as an angel of God. That's stupid. Let us continue. Why or, you, yes, I agree with you. At that time, they used to hate. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, yeah, yeah. At that time, at that time, the Jews today they are time, better. Yes. The Jews today are yes. better. But at that time, they were bad. Okay. On that yes. prophet uh, recited the holy verse saying, 
whoever is the enemy of Jibreel, let him die in his fury. <laughs> and then he continued, for has brought, i.e. Quran, down in the heart of the permission, okay, and continue, and then he said, as for the first portent of the hour, it will be a fire that will collect the people from the east and the west. So Muhammad now is saying, there's a fire will come down and will collect everybody from the east and the west. Continue. And as the first meal in paradise, it will be the crowded eye extra, the fish liver, actually the, 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 the liver of the whale, the liver of the whale. And as, now Muhammad explained how the baby resembled the father or the mother by gender. He says, and as if the man discharged proceed of the women, then the child resembled the father. And if the women discharged proceed of the man, the child resembled the mother. When when Abdullah, he, he heard that, he said, I testify. I testify that you must be the prophet of God. Is that a story proving that Muhammad is a prophet or proving that he is a scam, my friend? He was testing him, man. No problem. No problem. The guy, when he said, he, I testify that you are a prophet, was he making yes. fun of Muhammad or really he believed Muhammad is a prophet? No, no, he was testing him. To, okay. To, to okay. Tell How he testing him? When, when Muhammad, he said, when Muhammad, he said that as, as, as the, why the, the question was what? The question was how the baby and what makes the baby look like the father or the mother, correct? The answer was Muhammad, your prophet answering, as for the baby, how the baby resembled the man or the woman, which may be a male or female, he said. And if the man's discharge proceed of the women, then the child resembled the father. And if the women discharge proceed that of the man, then the child resembled the mother. Is that a prophet talk or this is a person making fiction story, stupid story? No, this is the unseen matters, man. What's what? Is the unseen knowledge? What unseen knowledge? You can go right now and go because he, talk got, about it, it he got it from no, no, no. How he received the knowledge is that Angel Jibrail re mm. received revelation from Allah. Thank you. So, so he gave the so, information. So now, so now this is an answer coming from Allah. So if this answer is coming, yeah, from, yeah, Allah, it's coming from Allah, of okay. If, if, if the answer coming from Allah and the answer is wrong, it's mean Allah is a fake God, correct, guys? Do you do we agree, Hassan? Do we agree? That if this answer, I, if the answer no, no, is wrong, no. if the answer is wrong, it means Allah cannot be God, and Muhammad can't be a prophet. No, 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 no. Because Jibreel told him that. Okay, but this is wrong. I can ask anyone there. Look, look, look at the text. People are laughing. Look at the text. Where's the signs? Hey, people in the text. Who of you believe that if the women have orgasm first, the baby will be a girl? If the men have orgasm first, the baby will be a boy. Who believe in that? Nobody. I don't know the the the. The interpretation of that, my friend, uh, it's very simple. It's, a, it's very simple. It's in front of you. It's front of you. It has context, man. It, it's have a context. That's, the context is there. What's wrong with you? No, no. That's that's the apparent apparent meaning. Apparent understanding. It's not his code like apparent. That. It's not kind of apparent. The guy is asking him very simple question. The guy there is not a doctor. Muhammad is not a doctor. That's he claimed, why I said our scholars he claimed, he claimed that the means. one who told him that is Jibril. He's saying why the man, why the baby resembled the father or resembled the mother. The man I Muhammad, he said to breathe. He told me that. Look, if we go back, look. I you're, affirm it. You're a prophet. Your prophet is not saying. I said I affirm it. I what? I affirm it. I I, I, I accept that okay. narration. No problem. I, I know you accept it. This is not the problem. But you see the problem yes. here. Muhammad is not even saying. I'm guessing. Maybe I'm wrong. No, he's saying just now. Jibril told me. Do you see? It says here just now. And where is Jibril getting the information from? From Allah. He's getting from Allah. Thank you very yeah. much. Okay, so if the information is wrong, it's mean there is no Jibreel, there is no Allah, and Muhammad is a false prophet. No, no, it doesn't make him like that. What do you mean? Doesn't mean it, it says uh, who in the world believe that? If so you want me to leave Islam now? I'm not asking you to leave Islam. I want you to stay as a Muslim. If you leave Islam, I'm, I'm, I'm going. If, I go if to all Christian, the Muslims love has, Islam, I'm going to laugh at you. Things. You know, my friend. I cannot become Christian. I cannot become Christian. I don't because want you to become Bible a Christian for now. I, I want you to stay Christians. Muslims because it's fun. Listen. Do you really believe that if a man have orgasm first, the baby will be a boy? Do you really believe in that? I don't know about science, to be honest. I don't know about to science too. I'm not. A, I'm not a scientist. You know, the, the highest do, degree. Do you have, have science proof? The, the only like the only license no, no. I have is a driving is it, license. My friend, this is another question. Can you prove it? Can you prove that is 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 not uh, is not that case? Can you can do you have evidence for that? What evidence of what? To to disapprove what the prophet our prophet said. Yeah, we can it. we can go right now to Google and we can type. Guys, you you type you type for Mr. Hassan. 
I don't know about sinus, to be honest. So that's why I said my I friend, cannot. My friend, cannot you can you can type right now in Google how the baby gender is narrated and how and what make the baby resemble the father or the mother. Very simple. Have nothing to do who come first. This is yeah, that's why I said I'm first. not sinus. So, so so you're a prophet making it so clear that he is is a false prophet because he's talking about if the man discharge proceeds. No, I said I affirm it. I said it's true what he said. I didn't say he lied. Can I you, I, you I know I know what you said. Yeah, I'm then why, why I'm are you questioning? I'm explaining to you that this is cannot be true. No, it's true. Pray with me. I said it's, it's true? true based of me, it, based of me not knowing about the signs. That's oh, why so, I said. But, so but you, the narration, you, you believe but the narration it, you of be, that, you I have, be, you I have found it. it. Okay, you believe in that just because uh, your prophet said that, but not yes, because it's said, true. Yeah, yes, yes. Okay. I believe in because he said it. Okay, okay, that's, that's my point. Yeah. That's fair. That's fair. So yeah, let's move on now. So, so you, you, you are confirming to us that your prophet, he is a prophet, even if he say lies, and you don't care if it's true or yeah, not. According to your logic, yes. According to your logic. Not, not according my logic. Not my logic. Everybody, any, you can ask any kid. They will tell you that this is a, this is a stupid. There's nobody believing. I will in such not a thing. become Christian because Christian itself is a false religion. So what do you expect me to do? My friend, the Christian is self false religion because Muhammad told you that. But look, Muhammad is lying. No, it's to a you. false religion because it contains a lot of evil things. If you read about the Old Testament, like, Shamsi like, was like, meeting. Like what? Like what? Tell me evil things. Shams Shamsi, his video. Do you watch his latest Let, video? Why he don't call me and get him? Busted. He don't. No, no. Did, did you watch? Did my you friend, watch? my friend. I posted under his video there. I told him, call me. I no, that's me. not my question. My friend, I'm my friend, my friend, my friend. Video. Yeah, I saw his video. I laugh at it. And not only that, what I post. Did he say about the I post. I post under his video. Says, if you are a man, call me. I read for me. That's not my question again. Let me answer you. Let me answer you. I said, my question. Shut up. Shut up. Don't make me hang up on you. Don't act like. That's not my question. I'm asking you. Don't act like a kid. Don't act like a kid. I want to ask you a question. Let me take another Muslim. Hello. Hello. Again. Hello. 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 Yeah. He he is your friend again. Who your is good the, friend? Who are you? My how are you, my friend? Uh, I was the one who asked you is uh, Jacob Israel. You uh, you remember? Uh, okay. Okay. And and you yeah, said yeah. Let, let, and, let us try. Let us try uh, to debate with, with respect. Without insults. Okay, right? let, let me ask you a question. Are, are you yes. still insisting that Jacob is not Israel? That, that I never said it. You said that? No, I never said it. You I said asked that. you, is. Huh? You said that? No, I asked you, is Jacob uh, Israel? <laughs> go, 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 go. This guy, did this guy, he insists that Jacob is Israel and he was making fun of me for saying that? Are you sure? Are you sure? Let us go to the book of Exodus. Are you sure? <laughs> now, because we got him busted, this is what his prophet teach. Now he don't want to talk about it no more. Let us take. Uh, 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 look like we have many calls here. All right. Stop talking to that guy. Talk, talk, talk to me. <laughs> okay. Yes, Abu Bakr, how are you? Uh, are you afraid? Are you afraid? Because you are a liar. You, why you don't admit your mistake? Why you don't admit? You made fun of your prophet. You made fun of Islam. You made fun yes. of Islam. You said that Jacob is not Israel. Okay. Okay. Let us go, let us go back to zero. Let's go to back zero. Okay, Jacob is how, Israel, right? How, how you learned that Jacob is Israel now? How you are convinced? What happened? No, you know, I never... Okay, okay. I, let me let me start from, from zero. Hmm. In Exodus chapter hmm. 4, hmm. verse 22, God hmm. said, you cannot deny that. God said, Israel is my son, hmm. even my firstborn. Is hmm. Jacob God, uh, God's son and his firstborn? Is Jacob is my father? Again, I repeat again. Mm. In Exodus chapter mm. 4, verse 22, mm. God say, Israel is my son, mm. even my firstborn. You cannot deny it because that is in your because this is a new Because this is a new nation will be called from now on the nation of Israel. So he is the first one to be called Israel. And if, after that, everyone will be called Israel too. No, no, no. He say he's no, it's no, my no, 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 Because now he's so, a new person. Because he is now. Because you see, my friend, my friend, my friend. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. 
Israel is the, the one who, who, he just, who he just named him. He just named him Israel, and now he is the first one to be called Israel. And if after that, all of them they are the children of Israel. So he is the first one. He is now born, and he is a new person. His old name it was Jacob, and now the name it changed. Now let me ask you: Did your prophet agree with that or not? No, you interpreted the. Did your the, prophet? The did your prophet agree with that or no, no, not? No, no. Did your stay, prophet stay, agree stay on, with? Did your, pro, did your prophet stay agree with that or not? I he stay. Said, I stay so, in the topic. I answered you. Now it's time to, for you to answer me. No, no, no. Did you your prophet? Not. Did your prophet show agree? Everyone, show everyone. Did, if you're did, a real man. My, if you're a real man. Abdul, if you're Abdul, a real man. Abdul, show Abdul, everyone. Abdul, show shut up. Every day I have to shout like like crazy. <laughs> <laughs> show everyone, show everyone, show everyone. <laughs> my friend, God does not have a children's. We call him our father. This is my son, does not mean he have a son. He gave birth to a son. Secondly, this is the new name of Israel. This is not his real name. God gave him the name. And your, your friend, the one, the funny friend who called before you, he said, yes, this is what the Bible teach. So it looks like you both of you are ignorant and you do not know what are you talking about. One is saying to me that the Bible is wrong. Jacob is not Israel. And the other one saying to me, Jacob is Israel. Yet you're a prophet agreeing with me, not with you, Abdul. When we ask a Muslim, where is the name Jacob coming from? They do not know. They say we go and read the Bible. But isn't it the Bible corrupt? They say no. Some of it is corrupt. Some of it is not. Let us go to Tala. How are you, Tala? Sheikh Tala. I'm great. How are you? I'm I'm fine. Fine. What do you want to say? I want to tell you. I want to first confirm you to, to you again. Hmm. Reading verse 159. You were telling me that in to Muslims, Jesus never died, right? That's what you said, right? Hmm. You're a you said Jesus, you're, you're, you're a prophet. You're a prophet saying that. No, prophet never said that. People said that. Okay, okay. okay. My friend, my, my, my friend, my friend. Uh, you, what, 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 uh, do, Please. Do you believe in the hadith or you don't believe? I don't believe on that hadith, on that particular hadith that said that Jesus did not. Allah said he died. My friend, that, I'm asking you. Don't don't tell me I don't believe in that particular hadith. It's not up to you. Either you believe in the hadith all of it or you don't believe in it. Do you believe in it or not? There's some there's some sahih, there's some daif, there's some good one, there's, friend, there's some life. Okay, do you believe in the sahih hadith or you don't believe in the sahih hadith? I said there's some bad hadith or the sahih hadith. This is not the question. I'm not asking you to believe in the bad hadith. Do you believe in the sahih hadith or, or, or huh? I say hadith sahih, they are not sahih. You believe in sahih, right? I said some are said sahih, they are not sahih. Do you understand English? Okay, I'm asking you why you are not brave enough to say which one you believe in. Every hadith that contradicts, I don't know where it is. Sahih or not sahih. Anything, contra contra anything contradict what? Anything contradict what? The Quran. Okay, anything contradict the Quran, they don't take it. Okay, the Quran says you pray three times. The, the hadith says you pray five times. Which one you choose? The Quran said five times. You're a liar. Show me. I'm going to tell you. Show me. Exactly. Show me. All second. Yes. Show Hold me. on. Okay. Yes. Okay, go ahead. I'm going to show you. Go ahead. You're a super liar. I'm going to show you right now. All right. Give me one second. <laughs> These guys are liar, man. Oh, my God. Let us laugh together. Yes. Hmm. I'm, 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 give me that one second. I'm, I'm looking at it now. If you want the verse, I, I have it in the screen right away. Uh, the, I don't need you to get help. Hmm. Yes. Okay. Give me one second. I'm going to tell you hmm. five times a day. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna tell you where the five times at. Mm. I, I heard you saying that that's a day. Mm. Yes, I want to come back. Okay. Accuse, accuse, accuse the book. I'm waiting for you. Lying. I'm wa I'm waiting for you. Everybody will laugh at you in a second. Nobody's gonna laugh at me because I know what I'm talking about. Let us see. No. I know nobody's gonna laugh at me because I know. You see, if you know your book, you shouldn't right away give me the verses. You are you are taking you forever looking for pages. 
because I'm at work. I'm just trying to be do do my best. What, to what talk kind to. of a person at work he is calling and chatting in the internet? You are a good employee. Go ahead. Yeah, I am a good employee. Mm -hmm. Yes, right. for having been six times the employee best employee of the month, right. six times mm -hmm. this month out of these 520 employees, mm -hmm. and I and I got six times. Six times the best employee, you know, right, right, uh, right, uh, right, right, right. Okay, now, uh, uh, what is the verse? Show me, yeah, give me one second, man. I'm looking, hmm. you know, I was already, I, I was going to talk about something else. Now, you, you, uh, you want to talk about the, the prayers? We're going to talk about it. I am running away from you. Don't piece. give me a headache. You know what? I will give you 15 minutes to find it and call me back. Yeah. Let me call you back. Right. Call me back. You see. You see how much he's reading in the front of you it says and establish regular prayer at the two end of the day and the approach of the night how many of those three <laughs> if the quran saying to you five times if you want to show me verses saying five times it's mean the quran is a, is a joke how he said to end and one approach of the night it's a three stupid cult hello hi cp hello hey, my friend um, CB, I'm, yeah, I just want to say one quick thing, just like let you carry on with your stream. Okay. Um, the story about the Abdullah asking uh, uh, Prophet Muhammad about uh, knowing three things which only prophets know, mm -hmm. and after um, uh, Muhammad gave his answers, mm -hmm. he's um, uh, Abdullah said, "Okay, um, you, you are surely a prophet." Then, if Abdullah mm -hmm. knows the answers, then he must be also a prophet as well. Correct, because uh, because, because only prophet they knew that. So how Abdullah himself he knew the answers. The whole story is fake. The whole story is is fabrication. It shows how hypocrite the Quran is, and it shows how the hypocrite the Hadith is as well. Yeah, I mentioned that so one time before. You see, if he said he said to him from the beginning, I will ask you about three things nobody knows unless he, he is a prophet. But the guy himself yeah. he knew the answer. <laughs> So, so he's a prophet too. I mean, do you, see, do you see how secret it is? At, nobody knows. Nobody knows unless he is a prophet. <laughs> All right, my friend. Thank you for calling. Right, thank you very thank much. You, thank you. Thank you. Call me, uh, uh, Sheikh Tala. I'm waiting for you. Five prayer, right? <laughs> and he's excited. <laughs> The Quran in front of us, what a stupid book, full of contradiction. If God, he says to you, you pray three times, it's mean you pray three times. That's it. He mentioned to you the prayer of the day. Hey, Muhammad Hassan, how are you? Uh, hello. Welcome. So what do you say, yeah. Muhammad Hassan? What, what, what Did you do some search and call me back? Uh, what I'm saying is that... How many prayers the Quran said, Muhammad Hassan? Hello? How many prayers mentioned in the Quran? No, I want to address. Uh, okay, okay. You want to address a new topic now? Address what? You want to talk a new topic? Sure, go ahead. New topic, no problem. Yeah, you're asking me a question, so go ahead and ask me a question. Okay, I will ask you. What is the topic you like me to ask you about? I don't know. You're the one who who is in charge. Do you like me to ask you to... about things in heaven or things in earth? And ask me anything. Anything. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, let me ask you. Uh, you know that your prophet was under the control of a black magic, correct? He was possessed, yes. Possessed. Thank you very much. Okay. Did, did you hear Mr. Muhammad saying that he was possessed? Okay. Yeah, what, it was what, one incident. One okay, incident. no problem. What what it's mean to be possessed? Explain to us. Not all possessed. times. Not all no times. Problem, no Remember. problem. No problem. What, what Don't do you, misquote me, please. No, no problem, my friend. I did not misquote you. I did not say all the time. I did not say one time. I did not say anything. Yes. You said yeah. that he was possessed. What possessed mean? Uh, I think uh, he was uh, something, you know, the magician, what mm. they do. What they do? He put something on his hair or something like that. I don't remember the whole story exactly, okay. but he did so, something to make him... Uh, he, to make him keep forgetting in you know his mind wasn't functioning because what he did the magician he performed mm. so he yeah so that was one story i think it's authentic narration if i'm not wrong but i don't remember the whole details of the story but it happened all right so so you you agree that your prophet was possessed and but then after that there was three chapters chapter 112 to chapter 30 113 114 was was revealed to to, to seek to use it as a protection for ma magic 
All right. uh, uh, anything harm. Uh, you know? Okay. So it was authentic. Yes, authentic. Okay. I cannot. Okay. I cannot deny. How we can protect ourselves from magic according to the Quran? I said there was three chapters. The last three chapters friend, of the Quran. I, I understand how we can protect ourselves from magic according to the Quran. Do you know? Christians or as a Muslim. No, you are Muslim, Muslim. I don't want, I want to be a Muslim, so I'm going to how I'm going to protect myself from magic. You see, I, there's many people uh, after uh, me. They want to put magic chapter, on me. I give you the Quran. I have, a, I have a friend. His name is Sham Shamoon. He shaved his head because he don't want anyone to steal his hair and do magic for him. According to chapter, uh, that guy, I think he's, he's maybe he has mental illness. It's not much. No, he's maybe very he smart, is. my friend. He's, he's smart. No, no, he has mental illness. illness. No, don't don't so. disrespect my brother. This is my brother. Be careful. Uh, chapter no, one thirteen. No, Chapter 113 verse number four it says in order to uh, uh, To protect yourself you have to do and say certain things and he said that Muhammad people they can make for you a magic By making a knot in the rope and they blew in it <laughs> Do you believe in that? Uh, I don't know about the magic world to be honest. No, I'm not saying about magic words. They make a knot They make yeah, a the knot. Quran. Yeah, I, okay. I accept it. Yeah. They make a knot and then they blew in it oof, oof, oof. Do you really believe that's, that somebody can control you by doing that? That's one of their practices. What What is the practices? That uh, they're tying the notes and then they blow something because the magician they do different things to perform. You see, the magic. we switch all the translation. Finally, we found one is no. I, I accepted. Okay. I did, so I did they blow. I they did blow deny. in the knots, my friend. Yes. I I want you to blow in the knots to control me by magic. Can you do that for I'm, me? No, I'm not magician. I cannot do that. Okay. Can do you know any magician can control me from far away by blowing by the knot? Like he just a tie knot and oof, 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 you know? not all not all of them. Maybe some they can do. Ah, some. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Is, is magic do. is magic is evil? Of course, it, ch it 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 changes the functioning of your brain. Well, that's wonderful. It's evil. So you agree? It's evil. It's evil. Yes. Who is the thing. first one who taught magic? I think. Uh, Suleiman time, you Su know Suleiman. Suleiman, he taught magic. He was he opened magic school. No, no, no. Suleiman, some people, some of his followers, they taught ma ma magic. Mm. Some of his followers. Are you sure? You know Suleiman, Solomon. I know him. We used to work together. Solomon, Prophet Solomon. Ah, Prophet Solomon. Okay, I thought my neighbor. Yeah, his followers, his followers, some of his followers were misguided, so they start teaching. Well, I don't uh, know. Magic. I, I, my friend, I don't know where you get this information from, but the Quran it's says. It's in the Quran in Surah Baqarah. Yeah, the Quran says that Allah He opened a school for magic. No, no, uh, where? Here we go. The Quran says that Allah He sent uh, two angels, Please. their name Harut and Marut. And they open a school to teach magic. It was a test. Remember, don't misquote. My it friend, was a test. my friend, that doesn't matter. You you said to me the bad people. You said you said to me first it's evil. You are the one who said magic is evil. But why Allah then sent two angels, their name Harut and Maroon, to open a school in Iraq in the Babylon to teach magic? Why he did that? Why Allah he did that? Uh, there's a context of it. Let me explain. Go ahead. Can I explain? Sure, sure. Because those two angels were sent to test the people. Hmm. Can you hear me? Yeah. They were sent as a test, and they, they 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 told the people, please do not perform magic. We are only to test your faith. If we do it, you will be saved. If you don't do it, the then you are a good people. So they were test. God commanded them to test them. Okay. But so, they didn't perform so Allah, with the permission okay, of okay. God. Guys, look, look at this verse in front of us. This is the proof that Islam is coming from the true God. There's no question about that. Allah, he decided two angels, their name is Harut and Marut, to open a club and a school to educate you. To test get... them, to test them. And my friend, hold on. Uh, to, 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 to teach, to teach. Uh, Not to teach, to test the people. Uh, yeah, but they... no, they are teaching. Read with me. Here we go. They taught anyone. They taught anyone. You see it? Taught meaning they are testing. No, they, they are teaching. Test. No, my friend, they are teaching. Stop Here we go. Read, 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 read with me. Read with me. Read Let with me. Let me explain. Let read, me explain. Read with me. But the evil ones teaching men magic and such as thing as came down at the Babylon to the Did angels, you? to the angels, Harut and Marut. So okay. who is the first one who knows the magic? The only two they knew magic in earth. It was Harut and Marut, right? You're you're not reading the whole the whole chapter. The read whole it, I, okay, read the it. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm listening. Go ahead. Read it. What happened to Sheikh Talal? He he said he want to give me. He want to find the five. Uh, what prior. did they say? Huh? Let me explain. But neither of those taught anyone hmm. without saying we are only for trial, so do not 
plus for mice. Mm. We're only trial. We are, we are only for trial. Read the next the next line. Mm. We are only for trial. So do not. So that means they were sent to test the people. That, that was the objective. That, that's wonderful. That the... That's wonderful. So you are saying to me, be, before you join join the magic school, who rebooter. The angels, oh, the, the, next the, the angels, they make you sign disclaimer that this is only a trial, yeah. right? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, yes. guys, did you hear this? The angels, they make you sign a disclaimer, say this is only we teach they you only for you, a they trial. They warn you. They warn you. They, the they warn you. Thank you. It's called disclaimer. Disclaimer. Okay, we are not. Yeah, yes, we yes. are teaching you, you how say. to shoot, but not to kill. The disclaimer. Disclaimer. Okay. Yeah, so, yeah, they so, warn you, yeah. But 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 the magic is that is there is a good use for it? No. It's a bad thing. It's evil. So why the angels are teaching evil? What's the objective of the story? You do not understand it. I, I well, explain. Ex to explain you. to me. You know, if if the I said those if, two if, angels were sent friend, from my God. My friend, if the magic and you agreed from the beginning, it is pure evil. So why the angels sent by Allah to open a school in the Babylon to teach magic if it's evil? So it's like me asking you why is there evil in the world? Is that no, a no, I'm not asking you that. I'm asking you why. I'm saying. No, Allah, it doesn't make sense. Your already we have already we have Satan is doing his evil. We do not need Allah to add more evil. So if Satan is not Allah and why Allah, me, and, Allah, Allah. and Allah is not Satan, why so Allah me, is doing Allah. the act of Satan? Now we have Allah and we have Satan. Both of them they are evil, teaching us evil. So why, why, are evil. Me? why are you asking me? Why are you asking me? I'm asking you because you are the one who said to me no, that. Do not ask me. I'm not the one who sent the angels. Um, no so problem. Not I'm not asking you, my friend. I'm talking to you. That's why I said, do not ask me that question. Ask Allah. So this question is see. very embarrassing because Allah obviously. No, is, no. Is I the said devil. ask Allah. Why are you asking me the reason? I'm not the one who sent the angels. Allah, so Allah, what, what Allah, you want? Allah is the devil. What's your point? Allah What's is your the point? Allah is the devil. I don't understand. Okay, Allah. I don't understand. I'm not the one who sent the angels. Allah is the devil. That's that's the point. According to your logic, yes, because we can move on now. No, it's not my logic, because you are the one who said. Ask Allah. You are the one who said to me. You are. You are the one who said to me. You are. I'm not the one who sent the angels. Are you the one who said that evil is uh, uh, magic is evil? But in this form, it takes us a trial. It doesn't take us. It doesn't as, matter. As doesn't matter. But it's evil. It's pure evil. So the why? Context is important. The why? Context why the angels important. are? Why the angels are teaching evil? The context is important. Okay, hold on, hold. Sheikh Tala, Sheikh Tala is calling. He's trying to answer us about, uh, about the the five prayer. How are you, my friend? Are you back? I'm back. Okay. Did you find the five prayer? Oh yeah. All right. Go ahead. I'm finding them. All right. Go to twenty four fifty eight. Allah said expressly, hmm. expressly. Hmm. Uh, what, uh, what, said, what is uh, again? What the verse you said? Quran. What? 458 24 5 8 24 5 8 you said dawn prayer the dawn prayer my friend the big two. Quran, the first what? Prayer. Quran what Quran what 24 5 8 brother all right, all right. go ahead read for me down prayer Oh, you need to open the book too? I thought you was gonna put it out there. Okay. Yeah, I, 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 I want to be sure what are you talking about? Go ahead. 2458. Okay. okay. I told you I'm at work, but hmm. it's not a big deal. All right. 2458. Hmm. Where is the five? What is the five prayer there? Yeah, it's verse after verse. I'm putting you a verse for every <laughs> prayer. Okay. <laughs> Listen now. Listen. Oh, I said 24 for, for a down prayer. Mm. You ask me a question. The, the, the whole world go, is go, listening go, to go. me. Let us laugh together. Let us laugh together. Go ahead. 2458. No. Allah ahead. said, All you who believe, permission must be requested by your servants mm. and the children who have not attended uh, property. Uh -huh. This is done in the uh, uh, in the three instances before the down prayer. You see, down prayer? Mm. Now we're gonna go to next. Okay. I'm listening. I'm listening. No, one one by one. So how many prayer we have now in this verse? I got I got one down prayer first. Now I'm going to noon prayer. Hmm. Noon prayer is on 1778. I'm gonna read you 1778. Hmm. 1778. I'll show you that you you do nothing but lie, but hmm. lies is not gonna let us, stand. Laugh. let us see who will laugh at the end. 17 what? Yeah. 78? 1778. Hmm. Now, did you hear a down prayer? Did I read down prayer on 17 uh, on, on, on 24? Read, 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 read. Go ahead. Yeah. Wow. 1778, did I say, right? Hold on. Noon prayer. Hmm. 
you sh you shall observe the contact prayer, Salah, mm. when the sun declines. Mm. When the sun declines, see that? Mm. When the sun declines. Mm. Okay? Mm. That's the that's the noon prayer. <laughs> what what is, what 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 the noon prayer? Where is the noon prayer there? When the sun declines. The 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 noon prayer? The noon yes. the noon prayer. Where, where is that? It says that where? 1778. Uh, read it for me. Read, Seven, the, read the verse for me. Read the verse for me. You shall observe the contact prayer when the sun declines from his from its its highest point mm. at noon. Okay. As it moves towards sunset. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's 1778. You are reading what translation, my friend? Hey. Pick any translation you want and read it for, for, My for the world. Okay, so now you accept all the translation, all the translation accepted by you? Arabic. It don't matter what translation. My, my friend, my friend, my friend, my friend. Do you accept all the translation? Yes or no? Do you accept all the translation? Do you accept all the translation? I want to be sure which translation you are reading. I'm reading in Arabic. Does not matter. It doesn't matter. Okay, read for me. Re read it for me in Arabic. Then what, what do Luke mean? No. No, I want the world to hear. It. No, read for yes. me. You said you are reading in Arabic. You do not read translation. You are a liar. Read for me what the word the Luke mean. What? Where is the word? It says the noon in the in the verse there. Which one? I said when the sun declines. Where it says that in Arabic? Show me the word. I want to see the word, my friend. What's wrong with you? It's no problem, brother. Whatever you want. I'm going to fry your read ear. Read for me, that. read for me, read for me the verse. Read for me the verse so we can laugh together. Read for me, read for me the verse, my friend. I'm going to read 1778. I'm going to read for you. Read for me the words in Arabic. Which word in Arabic <laughs> there? It says in the noon time. Which one, which one is the noon time? Which one is the noon time? Which one? Which word? 1778. Uh, Which one is the word noon time, you idiot liar? You do not know even what you are reading. You're waiting, patient, this is why, this is why. Sorry, there's a commercial here on this website. This is why you cannot you cannot read the word because you're a liar. You are a liar. Which word? Don't read the whole verse for me. Which which word is the one saying noontime? Which one of those? Let me. I told you 1778. Let me Which read one of the verse? Which which word? Which word? You can read the whole verse. You cannot, you don't know Arabic. Get lost. Get lost. Don't ever call me again, you coward potato. You do not know which word is the one which is the noon time, but you want to read for me the whole verse. Do you know why? Guys, they have they have what is equal to Arabic. They read in English or Latin, but they are not really reading in Arabic or like in Urdu, but they are not reading in Arabic. They, they resemble the sound. That's why when I ask him which one is the word it says noon time, he do not know. Let me read for you the whole verse. This is not what I'm asking you. Which one is the word? Which one is the word? Don't call me Hassan now. Just wait. Which one? Which one is the word which is noontime? You don't know. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> yes, my friend. How are you? Uh, my friend told me uh, you deserve the capital punishment. Oh, okay. What is that? Death? He said, "If you lived, if you lived in a Muslim country, the leader should have killed you right, right now." Okay. Well, my you, friend, not me. My friend, you, uh, tell your friend you made me fart. No, my friend said, "Not I, I'm me." Telling I'm you, I'm Muslim. telling you what he told you. You know what he told you. Know, me. He, he told me. I'm telling you. Tell him, Christian Prince. He said yeah. you made you made him fart. Okay, I'll, I'll tell him. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now let so me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Uh, that's that's not me who said. Okay? No problem. No problem. No problem. I, I I believe you. I believe you. You are, you are a very truthful person. It says here okay. in chapter eleven, verse one fourteen. I want you to read for me and tell me what this verse is saying. Uh, I cannot see on the screen. This is the only verse in the Quran speaking about how you pray, or let us say how many times you pray. It's the, it's the period of times where you pray. No, what times? This is the, the only look. The verse is so clear, and establish regular prayer at the two ends of the day, and at the approach of the night. How many times the total? Uh, it, it can be five or four. Where is four? Read with me. Establish, Establish regular, regular prayer, prayer at the, the two, two ends, ends of, of the day. This is two, right? Mm. Okay. And the approach of the night, what is the total? 
uh, let me explain at the two end of the day it can uh, it's the morning yeah evening Thank and you. afternoon so those are three and the two nights are no, fisher no 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 the end of the day it says but how, how stupid are you it says two it says two end of the day not the three end of the day <laughs> if it it doesn't my mean friend it, it says no let the me, end of the day speak. the end of oh, the day man. the end of the day you just let, let your so dad you, just shut up please shut up i can't take stupidity no more it says the word two how the word two became a three The two end of the day, it means three. The two end of the day and the approach of the night, the total is three. The other idiot, he's trying to find me verses in the Quran. Sheikh Tala, did you find which word it says the noon time? I told you, I never said noon. Did, I said, did you find the word? Did you find, don't waste my time. Are you a kid or an adult? Did you find the word? Did you find the word? Yes. Okay, which word? Yes. What is the word? <laughs> Which what what is the word? I said I said it. Lidunuki Shamsi. Why you did not say that what? to me right now? What when I asked you why you did not say that? Because you do not know, right? You did search. I didn't have the thing in my memory. I had to read. My friend, and then you no, no, I told you which word. I did not ask you to read the whole verse. Listen to me. Okay. I'm not listen, a listen, listen. I gotta... Let me get you busted. No. Let me get you let me get you busted. This is the diction this is the Arabic dictionary. As no, long you claim no, that you speak, as long as long you speak Arabic, as long you claim you speak Arabic, read for me what the dictionary says. Let me let me tell you. I, I don't have a dictionary. Read let me the dictionary. Read the dictionary. It's in the front of you. I don't have a dictionary. I have it in the screen. Read it. This is your Islamic dictionary. Uh, 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 listen to me. I said it's five prayers. I read the dictionary. Hmm? Let me tell you the five prayers. The read Quran. the dictionary. Let me tell you the five prayers then in the shut Quran. Shut up, you coward. Don't ever call me again. What a kid. You see, they don't want to read the dictionary because they will get busted. This is not an additional prayer. This is the same as we see in chapter 114. The approach of the night. In the old days, the approach of the night is not really like now. Like now, you know, to say night is like, you know, uh, you, the night is something really long. And if we know that the Jews, even the Jews, they established a Sabbath, as soon as the sun, sun set, it is a new Saturday. The Sabbath is not really about middle of the night like now. So when the sun set, don't call me, don't call me, don't call me, coward. Don't call me. When I show you the dictionary, that means I got you busted. And this is why you don't want to read it. Don't call me. What a coward you are. I have no time for kids. There's many Muslims who want to leave Islam. Many Muslims want to leave Islam and we have to help them. I have no place for cowards. If the Quran says the two end of the day and the approach of the night and you are trying to prove to me that it's not right, that's mean you are trying to prove the Quran to be wrong. Was Allah wrong when he said the two end of the day and the approach of the night? Obviously he must be wrong, you know, wrong according to this guy. I am not the one who's saying that. And just to show you how stupid you are, you're a prophet will get you busted. Muhammad, he confirmed it clearly that he did not receive the Quran, uh, in the Quran, the prayer five times. It was Allah who gave him the prayer five times when he went to heaven, but not in the Quran. It was after a bargain between him and Musa and Allah. Hold on, Hassan, hold on, don't call, hold on, hold on. Wait, Hassan, I will tell you to call me when I'm done. Hold on. If we go in the hadith, we will find the following. Uh, when Muhammad, he went to the seven heaven, seven, eleven heaven, you see that when the Muslims, they try to prove me wrong, they get their prophet busted. Because if the story you are telling in the Quran is true, it means the story here, or the one you are trying to say it's in the Quran, that means the story here is a lie. Let us see. Uh, here we go. Guys, read with me carefully. How Muhammad received the order of a praying five times, was it delivered to him by Jibreel? Or it was delivered to him 
in the heaven of Allah, but we do not know how. After Musa has asked Muhammad to do bargain with Allah, read carefully with me. The messenger of Allah said, Allah joined 50 prayer upon me, my nation, and I came back with that until I came to Moses. Musa says to me, Khabibi Muhammad, Khabibi Muhammad, what your God is joining for you, Muhammad, upon your nation? I said, he has joined me with 50 prayers on me. Musa said, Khabibi Muhammad, Khabibi Muhammad, go back, Muhammad, go back to your Lord. You know, Musa is a Jew, they are very good in mathematics. Your nation, Muhammad, your nation are not able to do that, Muhammad. Then I went back to, to, uh, to Musa and I told him, actually, you know what? Let me show you the story, more details. This one, I don't like it. <coughs> Hassan, didn't I tell you, wait until I finish? No, let me, let me state one point and then I go away. Okay, hold on, hold on. Do you believe in this story that Allah, he told Muhammad to pray 50, 50 prayer? Yes. Okay. Why Musa's? Why why Allah given Muhammad fifty prayer? That's his wisdom. I cannot question. Okay. Can you discuss with Allah and you can can you make Allah change his mind to change? That's the, prayer? the unseen matter. That's the unseen. I cannot comment on that. What do you want me to do? What do you it's mean? Unseen. You, what do you mean unseen? It's it's the, the story. Unseen is then in the heaven. I wasn't the there story, to experience what was taking place. The story is in the front of us, my friend. The story. It's like me asking you why God put us on the uh, on the earth to cause evil and corruption. It's mm -hmm. like asking no, you like this that is not question. The question. It's a stupid question. Why Allah He asked Muhammad to pray fifty times? That's the unseen. I cannot comment on the unseen matters. I, I wasn't there. What do you mean I cannot comment? Why he gave him 50 and why he made it? That is, it why that is do you think God will give this count from 50 to 5 just because Musa is the Jew? He asked him I to ask for a discount. The unseen can you, I can you, can you, dusk, can you, uh, can you, like, can you ask God for discount in prayer? That's why I said it's the unseen. What unseen? It's not unseen. unseen. It's in the front of us. The, the story, in, place, the story is in the front unseen. of us. It says that Allah, he gave. Yeah. He gave Muhammad 50 prayer. But you are questioning me. You're asking me why. I'm asking you what is the reason why he gave him 50? Was so Allah that's wrong? That's why I said I wasn't there to ask God why. Why did, why did you give us 50? What? That's why was I'm Allah, was that's Allah, my answer. Was Allah wrong? Was Allah wrong? According to you, not me. Hmm. Let us read here. Let us read the story here. I, right. I get the whole story. I already know. What's your point? I don't Guys, read, read, oh, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Let me go. Let me read. Are you Guys, crazy? Read, read with me. Read with me. Read. Let us see who is the clear, crazy here. You want me to leave uh, Islam? Uh, no, I don't want to leave Islam. If you leave Islam, I, I will laugh at who? Stay as a Muslim. Read me carefully. When Muhammad, he went to the seven heaven, which the story is amazing, after after they installed a dish of wisdom and dish of etc. Okay. And look here, Muhammad, he saw in the heaven, uh, uh, a palace is made from lu'lu, from rubies and from uh, pearls. <laughs> Actually, you know, he saw, he saw, he saw a river uh, a river in the edge of the river there's a there's a, uh, a palace made from rubies and pearls let me see where it says that um, okay 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 Let, let's go to the story here from the beginning everything in this cult is amazingly a lie this is stupid idiot he's trying to prove to me that Allah he gave in the Quran five prayer which is totally the contradiction of what it says here because Allah is not even gave him five prayer, he gave him fifty, and that a contradiction for the Quran, where the Quran says that Allah He said to him, pray in the two end of the day, and that a contradiction that Allah never said to Muhammad, pray right away five, and He never said that to him in Quran, but He spoke to him supposedly through a mysterious way, you know, delivery guy, maybe Jibril in the heaven, we do not know, but it doesn't say here how 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 this happened. <laughs> Don't call me Muhammad Hassan. Don't call me. Don't call me. Wait. After Jibreel came and he cut open all his body to Muhammad from all the way from his throat all down to his testicles. He took all the material out of his chest and the abandonment and he washed it with water of Zamzam. And with, with his hand, stupid, don't call me. Don't force me to block you. I will block you. Don't force me to block you. Don't force me to block you. Don't be stupid. Wash it with Zamzam with his own hand and cleansed 
uh, uh, the inside of his body Muhammad body is very dirty you cannot take Muhammad to heaven with the sewage inside him so we have to do laundry and then a golden tray contain gold bowl full of belief and wisdom was brought and then Jibreel stuffed his chest and his throat and the blood vessels with it <laughs> And now Muhammad is ready to go because he's so smart. Now he have a plastic surgery. They put inside him a dish of wisdom, a dish of belief. And the angel, he stuffed, he stuffed. Look, look, this is not my translation. And Jibreel, he stuffed his chest and his throat, blood vessels with it. The blood vessels of Muhammad are stuffed with belief and wisdom. This is Islam. This is what they are asking you to believe in. Now we continue the story to go where the prayer is. Is the prayer really the five prayer is coming from the Quran? No. It's from the Hadith. Even I can show you a fatwa about that. Even in the fatwa, it says that. Stupid Abdul, they have no idea what they are talking about. Uh, if we go down, you will see here, let us see. Here, guys, look at this. Then Jibreel took him around that heaven, and behold, he saw another river at the bank of which there was a palace built of pearls and emerald. He put his hand into a river and found its mud is like musk. See, guys, there's a palace at the side of the river. And the palace is made from pearls and emerald and rubies. And the mud inside the river is like a musk, full of hashish. And for he asked, what is this? O oh, Jibreel. Jibreel said, this is the kawthar which your Lord has kept for you. Wow, the, this is a river just for Muhammad. This for Muhammad. Muhammad will play in the river alone. He have his own swimming pool. <laughs> Jin, then, then Jibreel scanned with him, with Muhammad, to the second heaven. And the angel asked the same question as those on the first heaven, i.e., who is who is it? Guys, each time Muhammad want to enter the gate of the heaven, the angel is saying, who is this? Who is with you? Huh? Read, read carefully. If you go here a little bit, you will see the guard for the gate of the heaven. They ask question. Okay. When Jibreel ar arrived, he said, then he scandid with him into the heaven of the world and knocked at one of its doors. The dwellers of the heaven ask, Who is it? <laughs> oh boy. Uh, somebody tell those angels to install like a ring, a ring ball camera, security camera, face recognition. The angels who they are guarding the gate of Allah, they do not know who is in the door. And they are asking, who is it? And why the heaven of Allah have a door? Is that a physical door? Yes, it's not a metaphorical. As you see, even they are knocking at the door. They are knocking at the door. Do you see it? And then they ask, who is it? He said, Jibreel. Like the angels do not even know Jibreel. They are asking, who is this? They cannot even see behind the door. He's, they said, who is accompanying you? Oh, they saw somebody there, but they do not know who's that. He said, this is Muhammad. They said, 
has been he recalled <laughs> the angels of Allah they don't have the name of Muhammad that he is you know he's invited they check their list Muhammad 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 we don't see his name here how come we don't see his name so they are wondering has he been called he said yes like yes then they said oh he is welcomed so the daughters of the heaven became pleased of with his arrival and then they did not know what allah would do to the prophet on earth unless allah informed them i mean look look at the look, look at the logic guys everything is explained in details they don't know what allah want to do with the prophet unless allah informed them okay the prophet met adam look what how the prophet he met with adam if muhammad he said i am the first to be resurrected in the judgment day what adam is doing there what adam is doing there let it go let it go over the nearest heaven gabriel said to the prophet he is your father greet him the prophet greeted him assalamu alaikum adam and adam returned the greeting and said welcome welcome my son <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I was smoking too much hashish. So, what a good son you are. Behold, he saw two flowing rivers while he was in the nearest sky. He asked, What are those rivers? Oh, Jibreel. Jibreel said, these are the source of the Nile and the Euphrates. What? The source of the Nile and Euphrates are in the sky? In the heaven of Allah? That is proven by science. Where is the Nile River is coming from? Is coming from the heaven of Allah. Where is the river of Euphrates is coming from? Not from Turkey. Not from Japan. No, it's coming from the heaven of Allah. Then Jibreel took him around that heaven. And behold, behold. I like to say behold. Behold. Guys, come tomorrow. And behold. And behold. And behold, I turn my head up and down. I turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it around. And all what I can see, just a bunch of idiots around me. I mean, what is that? What is that? Stop watching Science TV. Watch Muhammad. He knew. He knew where the rivers are coming from. The Nile River and the Euphrates is coming from Allah in the heaven. They are running there right now. Okay. Then we continue. After he saw a palace made built of pearls and emeralds. You see, Muhammad, he will not live in a normal palace. No, no. It had to be built from pearls and emerald. It must. I mean, come on. This is the prophet of Allah. And then, uh, Muhammad, he'd been taken to the second heaven. The angel there asked the same question at the first gate, which means, who is it? Hello? Hello, I, I want to know more about this Harut and Murut. It's very funny about them. Yeah, we will we finish this story and then we can go back to Harut. No more, more no problem, my friend. Okay, right. thank you. You're welcome. I will call Harut and Marut immediately after we finish. Jibreel replied, They ask, Who is coming with you? Look like all the angels of the gates, they have no idea about Muhammad coming. 
there's a very there's a technical yeah. difficulty and nobody is informing anyone let us see oh we have a we have a we have a muslim on a debate look like we have a serious challenge here somebody texting me I have a very serious challenge who is accompanying you he said muhammad they ask has he been sent for he said yes they said he is welcome he jibreel ascended the prophet to the third heaven and the angel they asked the same question again and again okay unbelievable stop calling me man let, let someone else talk Abdul, the one is calling me i'm calling you back answer why you don't answer okay what we can do You are scared? Somebody is saying to me, are you scared? You ban me from the chat? I am not the one who banned my friend, the admins. Obviously, you are scary. Private setting, not public. Stream, please. No, I don't, I don't uh, ch chat, I'm private. All right. And then they said the same story, and then they took him to the fifth heaven, and then etc. And then look what happened here. We arrived to the story of the prayer. Uh, when he went to the seventh heaven, they said the same to him. On each heaven there were prophets, those names he had mentioned. Hello? Hello? Yes, my friend. It's uh, Abu Abdullah from yesterday. Hey, Abu Abdullah, how are you? Still alive? Okay, so. So, Abu Abdullah, let me ask, let me to, ask uh, you. Let me ask you. Why Allah gave Muhammad fifty prayer, and then because of Musa's Allah, He made him have a discount to five prayer? I think you just answered your own question. I, no, I did not answer. I'm asking you why he made the discount. Allah gave him 50. Why he made it five later? That's a strange question because you just said well, Rasulullah, when he went to the heavens to meet Allah, Allah prescribed 50 prayers. Hmm. And then when he went to the heaven where he saw Abraham, or he saw Moses, hmm. Moses said, uh, you're your people won't be able to handle it. I have experience Thank with, you. you know, the children. So it was Musa's, so it was that, Musa's, Musa's correcting Allah because Musa's is saying they cannot handle it. So Allah was making the wrong decision. Thank you very much. So what kind of God, he do not know that the people will not be able to handle it and Musa's he knew. So Allah, he did reduce it because of a Jew. How do you know that Allah didn't know? Well, because he gave him 50 prayer. You are the one who said that Musa says to Muhammad, your people cannot handle it, correct? Okay. Who is the one who discovered that your people cannot handle it? Musa's. Allah is the one who gave what people cannot handle, which is 50 prayer. Who is the one who told Muhammad, your people cannot handle it? It was the Jew, Musa. So why Allah did not give him the right number? If not Musa's now, the Muslim will be in trouble. He could have gave him the right number from the very beginning. Right. But from his wisdom, he didn't have to give Right, him right. So he and gave then, him 50. So waiting for a Jew to fix the, the religion of Islam, the, the, the religion of Islam now is shaped by Musa, not by Allah. It was Musa's who keeps saying to Muhammad, go and ask your God for discount. Read with me carefully. Allah gave him, gave me 50 prayer. He's following the, the night. The, then the prophet descended, tell him he met Musa's. And then Musa's stopped him and asked him, oh Muhammad, what did your Lord join upon you? The prophet replied, he joined upon me, performed 50 prayer in the day and the night. Musa said to him, your followers cannot do that. Go back to your Lord and reduce it for you and for them. So the prophet, he turned back to, uh, to Jibreel. So as it wanted to consult with him about the issue, and Jibreel told him his opinion, saying, yes, if you wish. 
so Jibreel scanned with him and Rizabul, and then he uh, and he uh, like he asked Allah, please lighten our burden as my followers cannot do that. So Allah reduced them or deducted uh, for him that uh, ten prior. So now we are we have forty. Why Allah He made the fifty forty? I just answered your question. No, you did not. not Why he did not say to him right away five? I mean, what the what the point of this bargain? Are we talking with God or we are talking with the guy in the grocery store? I already answered your question. No, my friend, you are not. You are running away from the from the answer. Why he reduced? Why he did not say to him, okay, you know what? This fifty is too much. I will make it five right away. What the point of Muhammad going up, going down in the elevator? Uh, this is a joke. It's like cartoon, like a Mickey Mouse. Muhammad going up, going down, 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 going up, going down. Call me tomorrow. Going up, going down, going up, going down, going up, going down. And each time Muhammad he go up, you know, he asked to reduce. And then he go down. Moses he said to him, Are you stupid? Go and ask Allah for more. So this is from the wisdom of Allah. What, what is the wisdom? What is the what is the wisdom? Where is the wisdom in that, my friend? If you will let me finish, I would have told you. This is from the wisdom of Allah. He, he subscribed 50 prayers. Mm. And then when Muhammad mm. met Moses, Moses said, your followers won't be able to handle it. Mm. Ask your Lord for reduction. Mm. When he went back, he went down to 40 and so forth and so on. And said, what's the five? Mm. This is from the wisdom of Allah. You can't ask why. But but, but, I, but, I don't, I, but my friend, I don't see wisdom there. I see I see stupidity because if Allah is wise, He knew that is going to be five anyway. So what the point of Muhammad going up, going up? What what happened? What the change happened in the life of Muhammad? In Abu Bakr and Omar and and Osman and Ali, why didn't they question us and say, Muhammad, this doesn't make any sense, but I can follow you? My friend, who said who said nobody did not question? Uh, Question. Ask my question. friend, oh, they they questioned the yeah. Arab. The Arab they made fun of Muhammad. The Arab they broke the teeth of your prophet. They made fun they, of him. They, what they, are you talking about, Muhammad? He have no teeth from the beginning of his life because the Arab beat him for lying. So don't tell me that not a question. I am asking you now. What is the wisdom behind that? Why Allah right. giving him fifty if fifty is impossible? Okay, so at the end of the life of Rasulullah, the whole peninsula of Arabia. Convert to Islam by killing, by killing, by killing, by by sword, by blood, and the same day he died, the same day, the same, the same day he died, the same day he died, Abu Bakr he waged a wage of war. Is that true? The same day he died, people left Islam. It's called Harubu Ridda, the apostate, the apostate war. So the people they heard Muhammad he died right away. He decided to leave Islam. They thought now Muslims are weak and we are done with this. When, when he conquered Mecca, it was a peaceful conquest. Right, very very peaceful, very peaceful. Don't change the topic, don't change the topic. What is the wisdom of 50 prayer? Why Allah gave him 50 if it is five, if it's going to be five? Do Allah knew the future or he don't know? So the question is, why did not the pagans of Mecca question this? Why did they Who told you did not to question it? Who told you did not to question it? All of them, they question it. They laugh at him. No one questioned it until you, you are the on. one who said you are the one who said he conquered Mecca. Mecca did not submit to Islam, surrender to Islam, he conquered it. You are the one who said that. After he conquered it, who dared to question? He is the shut up, man. Don't lie, don't lie, don't lie. You you just said you just said he conquered Mecca. If Mecca converted to Islam, there's no need to conquer it. He conquered it. He did not make it accept Islam. He forced it to accept Islam. He conquered. Do you know what conquer mean? I said, why did he do it peacefully? If what peacefully? If killer, how how you do how you do it peacefully yeah. by conquering? How you do it peacefully? It was a war. What peacefully? Could he, could he not have killed them. He killed, he killed a lot them. of them. He killed a lot of them already. He killed a lot of them. Just shut up, man. Don't 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 please. First of all, Mecca is his family. All of them they are his tribe. All of them they are cousins. All the people of Mecca are one family. They are Quraysh. If Muhammad killed them all, it means he killed all his tribe. He have nobody left. This is his family. Now, either you want to answer me, what is the wisdom? Either you answer me, what is the wisdom of this? Or you tell me, I don't know. What's the wisdom of what? Of giving him 50 prayer, but the fact he, Muhammad, he keep asking for discount. Because the religion that you're supposed to, but you're supposed to, let me ask you, let me ask you a question. I'll make it simple for you. If God said to me, I want you to walk 50,000 kilometer 
should I say to God I am not capable I will or, or I will be obedience You should say I'll be obedient. Of okay, here Muhammad is not being obedient because he uh, he go back asking for discount. Allah told you, Allah Allah told you, Allah told you fifty. That's it. Why you go back? How dare you to go back and ask Allah for discount? Do you think Allah is a kid? This imagine you go back to God, not King. You don't even dare to do that with the King. So what about doing okay. that with God? Who is the final messenger there? What final message? Where is the Muhammad? Don't, don't change the topic. How dare yeah, Muhammad? Right. How dare Muhammad? How dare how dare Muhammad? Right, to right, ask right. On, on the Muhammad here, the... my friend. Muhammad here is asking God to change his mind. Is that correct? He's a changing right. the order of God. He's asking God, you are wrong. We cannot do 50. You are being stupid. Nobody can do 50 prayers. So you have to give us a discount. You have to reduce it. Allah agree right. with Muhammad that he is being stupid. So he reduced right. it from 50 to 40. Let me ask you, when Allah well, he reduced it from 50 to 40, why Allah choose number 40? Listen, this is the argument that the atheists always put forth. If you, if you think it's stupid, then you're free to think that. Then you're a disbeliever. No, no, I'm, I'm asking you. I'm asking you why he did not reduce it to the lowest That's number. Not, no, no. You see, I, I'm trying to understand your logic. Allah, he gave him 50, and then he make it 40. Why he made it 40? One billion people understand logic. If you don't understand, you're free. None of you believe that's, in logic. You Muslim, you don't believe in logic. Don't tell me in logic. Do you believe? Do you believe that listen, Allah? Let me ask you. Let me be, be honest. Listen. Be honest with me. Be honest with me. Do you believe in Muhammad? He said that if the women have orgasm first, the baby will be a girl. If the man have orgasm first, will the baby be a boy? You you believe in that? He didn't say orgasm. Don't he, add words. Okay. He did, he said what then? What he said? What he said? Co correct me. Correct me. Correct me. Correct me. If Okay, read with me. Here we go, listen, listen, guys. He did not say Jesus, orgasm. Let us see who's lying. Let us see who's lying. Let us see. Let us see who is lying. It is orgasm. It is orgasm. Read with me. Why you are a liar? Why all? Of, why all of you Muslims you defend Islam by lying? The Messenger of Allah. Shut up. Let me read for you. Let me read for you. Let me read for you. Stop shouting. Let me shut up. You see why you have to hang up on them? You said he did not say orgasm. No, he said orgasm. Read with me carefully. And you are a liar. Don't call me. Don't call me until I read for you. Look at the screen. Look at the screen, please. Don't call me until I read for you. The Messenger of Allah said, The man's water is th uh, thick and white, and the women's water is thin and yellow. Which of them comes first? The child will resemble the parent. You said he did not say orgasm. You are a liar. Now call me and apologize for being a liar.